motherfucking vibes the NYCFC Feather Podcast with your boy Dave Doobie, a.k.a. Doobie Rocks. And we back out here, baby. We got the whole gang in here. Gang, gang. Sanchez, what up? Hey, yo. Hey, yo, the bad guys Chico. here. Chico. What up, gangster? Woo. <laughs> that was my <laughs> man's back in the day, yo. Mm. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> we we picking up right where we left <laughs> off last week, yo. <laughs> Sanchez, that dubstep, was funny. Yeah, that dubstep, that dubstep was wild, yeah. yo. Yo, somebody had a funny ass fucking. Uh, I want to say a meme, but they just had a joke. They were like, "My mind at three a.m. Oh, while John. I'm trying to sleep." Yeah, <laughs> John. Yeah, <laughs> that shit had me dying, bro. That shit was so fucking Wait, funny. It was he a was, clip of us going bugging out at the yeah. end. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> he like, he goes, nobody. Me, my mama. My mama my at 3 a.m. Yeah. <laughs> All four of us. <laughs> yo, somebody else hit me up, too, and was like, yo, not for nothing, bro. I used to really fuck with Skrillex back in the day. I was like, yeah, I bet you did, yo. <laughs> <laughs> it was a thing. That's all it was. I forgot huge. who it was, yo. Yeah. The Skrillex was like a huge ass act. That yeah. shit is crazy. Big times. But yo, shots to our LRC Tornsorio. Thanks for hosting us out here, man. Uh, Irv, what up, man? Gentlemen. It's good to be, it's good looking, to be back. You, you looking chipper. Chipper. Nice and bright and orange. You I like know. That. You feeling that good. I got a plug. Don't worry about it. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. Drop a bomb. We have another well-connected individual. Another one. Hey, you know. Another one. You could try. I was thinking about that. Over, <laughs> I was thinking about that. We were talking about that last week. But it's like, it's not really that we're well-connected. It's just we've made so many friends over the years. That's we've how been you, in this. That's yeah. how you get well-connected. It's like, but, like, it's not a brag. It's just, you know, that's part of. It is what it is. You, no, but, you, flex, you, but put you, in, you put in your work. When you come to this club, part of it, part of something ah, altogether. That's, the rock that's being about, well connected. My man's being mind. It's, it's about power. It's just about you know. <laughs> who you we know over the we years. Decide. Decide. <laughs> <laughs> we take what's ours. We take what's ours. <laughs> Yusef. What up? <laughs> what's good, bro? Finally. <laughs> the pod has <laughs> come back to LIC Tonsorio. Oh, my God. Dude. Oh, man. It's only been yeah. a week. Yo, we, I, I love the energy of this pod, <laughs> right? of this episode already. Victory oh, another Monday. one. Nico hit me up. He, yo, he sent me fucking, uh, fucking SpongeBob just with the morkos and the buggers and all types of shit coming out of his what face. The he was fuck? like, yo, dude be trying to hold himself together during the podcast. <laughs> <laughs> that shit happened fucking week, bro. Yo, bro. I was like, yo, fuck you, man. But you were sick yeah. as hell. That, right, shit, yo, that yo. shit had me dying, bro. Don't lie, bro. Watching that whole shit, I was like, damn, I'm about to get mad sick. Yo, facts. <laughs> All of us. <laughs> I'm like, Dave, Dave's just blowing buckets into Yusuf's yeah. orb. Bro, the whole time. <laughs> I should have had a mask on. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm glad y'all, y'all immune to all this shit. That shit was wild. Yo, but Nico had me dying, bro. That shit was wild. Funny, bro. But Yusuf, what up, man? Yo. <laughs> fuck this guy, yo. yo fuck you guys. Nah, I'm good. You know why? Oh, man. Because we fucking came and demolished oh, yeah. this fucking... Oh, yeah. Montreal team. This was this was I, to shit. me. It felt like, you know, in high school or like, them down south high schools where they play a bum ass team before the season starts. Yeah, yeah, yeah just yeah. to get the yeah. the SEC plays like the eastern, <laughs> eastern, <laughs> western, eastern, western, northern Mississippi exactly. county, state, county, state, FC. Like, whatever it's the highlight of the year. Yeah, like exactly. Fifty four you know? to negative that, three. That's days. what this game felt like. True. And the energy of the day, the vibes of the whole day were just. They just started out. Even even as shitty as the weather was, there was just that energy was just in the air. Like this shit was dope, man. I, I fucking but the shittiness of the weather even stopped with the game. Mm. Yeah, no, it really True. did. Yeah. It stopped the yeah. rain, and when the rain <laughs> gets washed away, yeah, it just stopped. The snow like slurry. <laughs> Lincoln Park reference too. It just stopped, so it was just like we got ninety minutes of pretty decent weather. Besides the mm. wind and the temperature. It was just like yeah. it was pretty decent. It yeah, was, nah, it was Rick. dope. Man. It was dope. Uh, we got there relatively early, but we was fucking looking for parking for a minute. Forever, bro. man. Everybody, oh, yeah. everybody, yo, get out of my parking spots, people. <laughs> like, I don't appreciate you guys driving. Go park in the thirty-five dollar lots, bro. No fact. <laughs> Keep the parking spots for the peoples. For the peoples, bro. Nah. Thank you. It took us maybe thirty minutes to find a spot. Damn. Yeah. Remember yeah, that car we were waiting for to leave? Yeah. Oh yeah. That, the, that, just chilling on. When Alexis, I went home, Alexis. was still there. Alexa? And the person wasn't still inside? No, but the car was still there. Double parked? 
No, there was, no, 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 was no, 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 in a no, car no. warming up the car the whole time we were there. And it just waiting for parking. You should have filmed them, bro. I told you, you get a cut of that. Oh, oh idling. Idling. damn. We don't narc here. <laughs> damn. No facts. That's my man. It's right for here. the earth, Yeesh. bro. This whole earth is over with, bro. <laughs> That's facts. <laughs> we're moving to Mars, bro. <laughs> Mars, bro. Nah, taking well, taking well, I don't know Mars, about bro. I don't know about us. He's like, fuck a stadium. I want to build my you know that. I want my own planet. Mars, to go to Mars. That, <laughs> that flight's gonna cost us about two billion. Nah, That's it. all good, bro. So. We got that. With inflation now, shit. <laughs> True. It's it's two weeks, two weeks from now, we're about accessible. to be all billionaires, bro. Save your rubles. Yo, facts, yo. <laughs> In a couple of years, they might be worth they something. They might be worth something, yo. I got tipped like 200 rubles one time at work or some shit i forgot rubles? no it was like three it was like 30 rubles you bought yourself a chip no i was like what is this or i don't remember the exact amount it must have been like much, 40 though. yeah i know and i was like how much is this this was like when i first started at the hotel yeah and i googled it and then it ended up being like 25 cents i was like oh, oh that's fucked up no i mean it happens like, the guy gave me like five dollars or whatever and then he's like oh we're visiting from russia here you go it's probably uh, worth nothing now yeah absolutely yeah. nothing. i mean it was 30 cents already so <laughs> now, it's probably now you owe money. Yeah, now you yeah. owe. Now you owe US. I have money, no bro. idea what happened to that shit. That's fucking funny, know. yo. Um, oh, yeah, Bodega was popping. It was mad people there. It was raining. It was for like, it was raining. For like everybody was under that tarp yeah, yeah. for like five minutes though. What? Then then everybody left to the march. Yeah. 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 Which honestly, I fucked the fa- I fucked with the fact that everybody was like on it. it was like yo, now we're gonna go to yeah, do, do this day march. One. Yeah, it's day one. It's day one. A lot of people, uh, I think it was Suki who made the, the initial announcement. Announcement. Uh, we all headed over the stands. Um, at first, I really didn't think the the march was going to happen. Right. You know, the weather Correct. was kind of shitty. That's what mm-hmm. we thought. And there the was car. no drums. Like, yeah. I didn't know where the fuck the drums were. And everybody was spread out. Like, some people were in yeah. front of Billy's, somewhere all the way down in stands, or mm-hmm. Yankees. I'm sorry, uh, Twins. Twins. They were outside of Twins and shit, and it's like, I was like, what? What's happening? And then just more and more people mm-hmm. just started showing up. Hell yeah. That march was great though, man. Lit. I really, I really love <clears throat> what made it fire was like because there was so much condensation in the air, like the smoke just stayed. It, it just kind of mm-hmm. stays there yes. for a little longer. Can I so give like, a PSA? Public service announcement. Yeah, go ahead, man. About the march. Oh, yeah. I said something to the dude, so I don't know if I should say something because it's not a bad thing like, per se, you know. But like, I got hit in the face with the flare. Oh. Because the um. You know the, the not the smoke bombs, the actual flares. The flares, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. when you pin. light them, it lights up and then it shoots out. Yep. That <sighs> shootout hit me right on my right on my side of my face. Right. Oh there. shit. Yo, I'm not gonna lie, that shit hurt. Like, I, it hit me and I was like, oh, so I just got rocked. <laughs> it was like a rocket. It was much. like it was like someone hit me with like a like a pea shooter with a rock right in the face. Damn. That was on fire. That was that on was fire. hot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That yeah. Was so he could have legit burned your eye. Could have lost the eye. Right yeah. here. Yo, it's swollen. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> but PSA, if you guys going to light the flares, light them down so yeah. it shoots down because it hit a girl, too. Oh, mm. damn. It hit a girl right next to me. Also, another a girl got hit. Yeah. I don't know what happened to her, but she was just, ow, and yeah. she just disappeared. Scars of war. <laughs> you know? But, like, just light them things down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? Light them down. Or light, light them down. Straight, or straight up. Or but prefer- straight up, yeah. Preferably, because then preferably just... down because down is safer for everybody. Yeah. You just shoot it down. You didn't think it would bounce off the, top, the street? Yeah, but it would lose velocity once it hits the floor. I don't know. You get that beeping. You get some nah, shorts. That shit hit me. That shit and it was ankles. only like from from distance from you to me. That's how close he was to me. Yeah. Either I way, saw him, either I saw way. the whole thing. I saw him lighting that thing, pop me on the. Oh, yeah. Either way, I'm sure it's it's easier and or it's safer to lie down and get your foot burnt than your face or yeah, an eyeball or some shit. Yeah, imagine imagine eye. I was turned or whatever hit me right in the eye. I was done. Yeah, yeah. that would have uh-huh. sucked, yo. I been in here like. Popeye, the same <laughs> the man. Nah. It was fun. Yo, there was a lot of first, like people's first sort of march or first real like just support. being at the game. And Be, shit. But even with like the supporter culture of going somewhere before yeah. the game march, then going in, it was like a lot of people's first time. I had a friend who who was his first time. He nice. He said he had to. He's gonna wear a mask next time. Because the smoke was just too much. I was like, nah, bro, you got to get used to it. <laughs> you got to live in it for a little bit. Yeah. It gets, it's fine. But that Your had, lungs will that acclimate. Had, that had to do with the, the condensation and the humidity in the yep. air. The yeah, the smoke air, normally the smoke, dissipates. The smoke didn't go nowhere. Yeah. It just stayed. It was just stagnant. Just stay but it just, it's just stagnant. It's like yeah. gasoline. You but just, it was fun. Like like you said, it was a, uh, from when we arrived to when the march started, there must have been no more than 30 minutes. Yeah. No, yeah, yeah, it was yeah, right yeah. away. And then from when we arrived, there was nobody out. Yep. And then so when the march started, it was like where all these people come from. Like wow, like yeah. like all they these mobbed people, out. 
all these people showed yeah, up, was which great, was good. Man. It, it was, was good. good. It was uh, it was nice to see. Um, there were a lot of cool banners. You know, Templados had a really cool one that took up almost the whole street. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, just fucking flares and fucking yeah. All it was types every, of and right shit. behind them, there was plenty mm-hmm. more, and it's like it yeah, looked yeah, good yeah. just to see everybody all together. Yeah, mm-hmm. it looked nice, man. Just miss representing home. the representing the team. Yeah, coming back home. Yeah, just miss fucking, being home. What a welcoming. What a homecoming, I should say, yo. Did Third Rail participate in the? Yeah, it was, yeah. They, yeah, were, there. Yeah, they were there. They were there. Everybody from, was there. Uh, Third Rail, New Jersey. Was but there. was there a banner? Probably. Uh, maybe a flag or something. I don't know. I didn't see a banner like a big mm. banner like that. But I think when the with the march, everybody, sh- every like supporters group should have their own banner, and That's then idea. all the representatives right mm. behind them. Mm. I originally wanted a long time ago every borough represented. Oh, that'd be good. Wherever like you're an from. Olympic Mark. Like an Olympic march. Yeah. Now, yeah, here comes now, the Bronx. Now the representatives <laughs> Hide your kids, hide your wife. Here comes yeah. the Bronx. Every well, though, has a different uniform. <laughs> Look at that. Shout out Bronx. to Staten Island for well, being number one. <laughs> well, they say, <laughs> they say. No, no, I, I said being number one because there's only like one from Staten Island. So <laughs> They Jeez. say they get the money. Here comes Queen. <laughs> here comes Queen. <laughs> With oh, my God, they're fighting. <laughs> <laughs> and here comes Brooklyn. Boo. <laughs> <laughs> Why Fuck does Harlem you. World have their own flag? <laughs> <laughs> Fuck all the world. Fuck, got it. Everybody's, they got the uptown Harlem flag. World. Yeah. <laughs> and it's just this? You just pink? <laughs> the upset oh. comes out and shit. Oh, yeah, man. Oh, man. Nah, that'd be fucking hilarious, though. Like, uh. <laughs> Olympic style fucking march with a torch, with all the flares, with the torches and shit. Hell yeah, man. Nah, but the march was dope, man. The vibes was crazy. Like, just the energy of that day, just going from like everybody super excited to see everybody, you know, because not all of us have seen each other since Portland. A lot of people didn't go to Portland. Mm -hmm. So a lot of a lot of people, the last time we really saw each other was in Atlanta. Uh, at the or, or, for the Atlanta game. match, excuse yeah. me, at Yankee Stadium. Um, yeah. At Yankee Stadium, so yeah, it was mm-hmm. it was it was dope, awesome. man. Just just being everybody, just being out there, um, despite the weather. Not everybody was there, obviously. The weather, yes, because it, it was. Brilliant. Yo, the, speaking of flares, someone just texted me and said the Watermelon fans. Obviously, we're recording this Monday, so we're not gonna we don't know what happens with the when this comes out Wednesday about the Communications games. Yeah, the Watermelon fans are outside the NYCFC hotel with fireworks right now. Oh, oh shit! No. Yeah, I mean oh. it's Concacaf and and it's. I mean, what time is it now? Latin America, bro. It's seven, probably two hours behind. Yeah, two or three is hours. Three? Yeah, two. It might be two hours. I think it's two. Oh, so it's that's nothing, like, bro. That's, what you doing? Just saying. Just saying. It's seven thirty. Let's see I mean, if they're gonna be out there until two in the morning. Let's see what time they go to sleep. Yeah, if right. it's three o'clock in the morning yeah. doing that shit. Then. They probably have supper right now. The team. Yeah. In the banquet hall. In the lobby. <laughs> yeah. They're on the other side of the hotel. Yeah. Just oh, yeah, making noise Shout out to everybody who went down there, who's going down there. True. Yeah. I saw Chadwick uh, is going. Who else? Andy Bahana's over there. Oh, where? Nice. I saw Lalo went. Oh, of course. He's the cook. Yeah. yeah. Chef. But he doesn't cook for them over there, right? I don't think, there, right? I, I don't I think don't he has a choice. I knew your man. He He's was not going for work. Mm. Heard he was I thought he was the, the practice facility cook, chef. Yeah, but that's the team travels no, with you, you, Lalo. No, like, they have banquets. They have no. The no. team cooks for them over there. Catered. They, they, they're they're responsible for the food. They they don't like just accept the food that comes in. They gotta. Yeah, so nah, you're 100 percent sure he's out there working? Um, if I had to make, put money on it, my personal money, I would say yeah. Mm. But yeah, normally teams travel with their chef because yeah. they have to stick to a specific a diet, like, nutritional. Yeah. But from what I was hot dogs, from what I know is that he's a he's a practice Shop facility yeah, but chef. But he's but not the actual chef for the, or yeah, but, for yeah, every single. But thing. they they travel with their cook. That's why the bubble. The so then, who knows if he's actually the away traveling chef? We he's could ask him inter- instead we, of yeah. We could ask him. <laughs> we here. could literally just ask him, you know? yeah. or ask him here on the pod. No, just ask him at the game. Man. But on that, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Anyway, um, yo, during during the march, as you said, you know, lots of supporters, lots of different things. I wanted to give a brief shout out to uh, our boys, Viejos SC, new SC, t- uh, relatively new SC. It kind of started really? off as a joke. Um, yeah, oh. because now they want to take themselves a bit more serious. You know, mm-hmm. like they actually oh. want to. We took them serious. Like they have a logo nah, and everything. Nah, yeah, yeah. Nah, I fucks with them heavy. Um, but yeah, they're, they're, they're organizing. That's another group. If you, I don't know what the age is uh, to be considered viejo. I mean, like. If you're an old head, I guess. You, I guess if you consider yourself an old head, you could reach out to them. Uh, you got their info? Uh, Ro- Rodrigo Barberano on Facebook. He's the one who kind of is. He hit me up directly telling me about it. Okay. Uh, he said it's nothing big, nothing about politics, yeah. just uh, trying to have a good time and whoever feels identified. If you feel like an old man, 
or well, women. It, I kind of feel like it's more of a social club kind of thing, like right. Bronx football social club. Yeah, you know, but they're there for NYCFC. Yeah. You know, they're they mm-hmm. get off. So, my so lawn. Dave, you're almost at um, you almost meet the requirement. I almost meet it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I got a couple more years. I'm gonna join. Nice. I'm definitely going to. <laughs> I'm gonna uh, quit everything and join them. You know? <laughs> yeah. I'll be there soon. Yeah. Give me two uh, months, maybe three, yeah, two months, <laughs> two three months. I'll be there. Yeah. <laughs> if there's any social media, I guess we can just yeah, put yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, Viejo says C. That means old men. Soccer supporters club, supporters club, yeah, yeah, yeah. or, or yeah. social club, whatever, yeah. either or. Yeah. Um, the other one I wanted to mention too was Third Rail Queens. Uh, they got a lot of cool things coming up. Irv, you uh, you have mentioned anything about that? You yeah, know? we were totally unsure about uh, what was going on with the Third Rail Queens. We haven't really spoken to them personally. Yeah. I went to Bar Forty Three last week to watch the Coca Cap Champions League match against Comunicaciones. Uh, obviously, Angela wasn't there because he was in Hartford. It was actually kind of empty because a lot of people who live in Queens went to the match in Hartford. Oh, that's good. Um, but it was a good time. It was fun. I met the owner. Nice guy. Really friendly. He had the TV on. Sound on. Clutch. That's going to be the spot from now on for me. If it's gonna, if I'm in Queens, I want to watch a match and it's away or something. Yeah, yeah. Uh, bar 43, bar 43 and Sunnyside, right. just off of the 7 line. Um, but yeah, I spoke with Angelo before the match outside of Yankee Stadium. It's him and his family, basically all of them, all participating and doing this together. His two it's, daughters. Yeah, it's yeah. it's exciting. His you wife know? also, I believe. Yeah, he said all of them. Yeah, he, he was like my my two daughters, my wife, me, whole game. He said he wanted to do like community service and all that. And uh, he said that. Yeah, he mentioned that to me. Oh, he he mentioned it in passing. He said that he'll uh, give us more information. He just wanted to do more stuff in Queens. Um, you know, mm-hmm. Under this banner and shit like that. Nice. So reach out, have them come on. Hell yeah, man! Yeah. That'd be Talk dope. about it. It's and a lot of fun the, uh, seeing all these groups coming out. The I last SC I wanted to mention real quick was a uh, a new one that just popped up, uh, Notorious SC, which um, no, Sanchez no, is uh, no, Mod- 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 I would say, right? Modeling. Yes, yeah, the brand new uh, membership sweater. You know what I mean? How you doing? Turn around, how sir. How you doing? Hey, how you doing? Show the camera. The Show your ass. Oh, <laughs> hey, hey yo. yo. Also, we're show the have... back though for real. We gotta oh, see man. it. I gotta get up to this. There you go. Get closer. I said get closer. Go, <laughs> go. I'll just throw the logo up. It's your birthday. Up, man. We gotta get this it's man to fucking stand up, yo. <laughs> there you go. This fucking guy. Jesus, the pot is ruined, yo. Motherfuckers twerking on this shit now. <laughs> After the initial podcast, we're gonna have uh, hey. well, we'll, 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 we'll have a guest. Come on, we'll have a guest. Uh, we'll talk more about. The Notorious SC. Um, I got a quick shout out. Go ahead. Quick shout out. All right. Let me get this. Before we go in, I'll continue talking about. Accurate. NYCFC so, stiff. I had a very really humbling moment mm. this weekend. About time. About fucking time, <laughs> you know. Jesus, right? Very few and far in between. <laughs> These moments occur. But Seamus. Okay. I bumped mm-hmm. into him at um, Seamus. Yankee Tavern before the game. And he's like, hey, I want to talk to you about a friend of his. His name is Kyle. Ah, damn. I don't know. How do you say this? M- Majewitz. Majewitz. Mad- Majewitz. Majewitz. Yeah. I mean, Kyle. We're going to call Kyle. him Kyle. Kyle. Shout out to Kyle, who's Kyle's a college student. student, and he's going to school for um, like media and podcasting and stuff like that, right? Journalism. Nice. Oh, right. Uh, I'm not sure if it's journalism. I, I believe it's broadcasting. It's, yes. There you Journal. go. Journal. Yeah. Mm. And he's writing a paper. On his favorite podcast. And guess what that podcast is that the paper is being based on? Which one? Let me guess. The NYCFC Forever Podcast. Let's go. Uh, you know the fucking box. Honestly, that was real dope when you said that. Yeah, that's fucking awesome, yo. Give, yo, it, when, give that man an A. He's writing a paper about us. Give him his degree. Dude now. writing a paper about us. Title, Four Guys Talk About Wildness. They just out here. <laughs> Four I got guys a just wild I got respect, a little. Yo. I got a little <laughs> snippet of it. Okay. And uh, I don't got the full thing. I uh-huh. got a little yeah, snippet a little of it, snippet. a little screenshot of it. And it says, the, one of the paragraphs goes by, the NYCFC Forever podcast prides itself on mm. being for the fans, by the fans. FUBU. <laughs> the show is hosted by Jonathan Sanchez, Dave Monsignor, Eric Bedoy, and Yusuf Rickard, four men who not only embody the team, but also the city. Mm. Thank you, yo. Thank you. Appreciate it. Thank you for writing my Woo. obituary. Please. <laughs> this early. <laughs> Don't say that. You know? Hey, I, that, I'm adding that. Come on, bro. I'm adding. Yeah. I'm, I'm putting it in my will. Nice. I embody the city. Hell yeah. <laughs> Somebody else wrote that <laughs> about me. Put it on. Put it on I'm my grave. Put it on my, put my, it on my grave, gravestone. Bro. Look right. at this part. That's fine. Look though, at this man. part. Go ahead. Even some barstool sports podcasts that push the envelope 
still do not feel as authentic to me as this one does. There you go. Bars. There bars. Go. Fuck Shots. bars too. Listen. They don't have the emotion that these hosts do to them. Watching this team is more than a hobby. It's their life. Ooh, facts. facts. Big facts. facts. Only oh, bars. Like I got the goosebumps right now. Yo, Yo Kyle. Yeah, that's dope. I want that, Kyle man. on the pod. Yo, let's Word. get him on. I want to. I want a copy of the full paper. I'm gonna. I want the full paper. Yeah. I'm framing it. Giving it to my mama. It. Sending it out to everybody. <laughs> <laughs> like Bob, gonna... all those Sunday dinners that I don't make it to. <laughs> this is good. This is look. We this made where, it, man. This is where it starts. <laughs> this is where the. This is the beginning. I got college students writing papers yeah. about me, man. Who are you talking to like that? <laughs> Come on, now. Nah, yo, but for real, Kyle. <laughs> what you mean? I gotta do my bed. <laughs> For, no, for real though, we got some deep rooted trauma it, on this man. podcast, yo, for real, yo. <laughs> appreciate that a lot. That's but nah, hell yeah, that's that's kind words and thanks thank for you, man. Thank you for wow, listening. So cool, yeah. Appreciate Good luck that. on your paper. Let yeah. us know how you did. I want you gonna fucking pass. A plus. I know gonna fucking pass. No, and if they no, don't, passing was you can get a D. Well, what we gonna put his professor a if you don't give him an A plus? We're going to we, find him in the streets. Where we going to put him? <laughs> and you know what? We Fuck it. We're going to pay off all your student loans. Come on. Hey, nah, you go. Just kidding, Sanchez. Listen, good luck. Oh, I want to see the final results. And um, nah. thank you. That's, that's dope, man. Nah, that's, that's dope, man. That's, that's dope, yo. Shout, that made shout my you, day Kyle. early. I can't wait yeah. to read that. I couldn't find you guys fast enough to tell you this. <laughs> yeah, yo, you came in. You were like, word. Uh, 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 bro, <laughs> guess what? You're not going to uh, believe this. Because uh, it was, it, I never expect that to happen. What school, do, what school does he go to? Uh, Rutgers? No, no. I think he goes to school in, uh, Jesus, give me a second. I want to hear Columbia. No, no, no. <laughs> Uh, Car uh, Fairfield maybe Fairfield University. Oh no doubt. That's what nice. it's in his bio. Okay. On um, oh, on okay. Instagram, Kyle Mage Five is mm-hmm. his Instagram. Let me see him. I, if I recognize him. Yeah, he was at the uh, city hall event. He looks familiar. I uh, no doubt, no doubt. Yeah. That's cool, All right, man. man. Yeah, we got to get him on. Shouts to you, bro. Shouts to us. Talk about talk about your paper. <laughs> Shouts to that. us. <laughs> yeah, hey, to hey, us, hey, hey. Good job. Yeah, pat yourself <laughs> on the back, boys. Atta boys. We are, we are not above a bunch of patting oh, ourselves yeah. on the back. Atta boys. <laughs> we'll take it. We'll take nah, it. Nah, bro. Uh, speaking um, of patting ourselves on the back, yeah, the we, podcast uh, <laughs> yeah, facts. <laughs> we did our jobs, though. They wrote a paper about yeah. it. So. Uh, patting ourselves on the back. Championship celebration. NYCFC. Yeah, we were Obviously, told to go uh, in early. Yes. You know, because it was going to be a whole... A whole thing. A whole, a whole thing. thing. I, I thought it was going to be a broad reproduction. Yeah. I, I, thought thought it was I was expecting fireworks. Dancers. There was no fireworks. The no rockets. Fi- I mean, I think the weather the rain, probably no. fucked it up. But the snow? Nothing. You Maybe can still wind. fire fireworks in the rain. You yeah. can, you can do poppers. You, you can hit the poppers. Poof. I mean, I want some shit. You know? Yeah, yeah, little sparkles? Little sparklers. <laughs> they had nothing. It was... <laughs> it was Yo, the oh, timing was way off. I think they did the presentation. Ian Joy came out. And he's oh, like, here yeah, comes he's, the trophy. And then stood there. nobody came out. And then they replayed the yep. video montage again. It was just. Yeah. Before. Yeah. And then I don't know what the fuck they were doing, what they were thinking, what was. Uh, Who's organizing this? Who organized I'm, this thing? But could we say that it's almost par for the course when it comes to NYCFC? Yeah. Sure. I like, mean, like, yeah. Like, is it our fault that we expected more? Yeah. That's yeah. true. Yeah. <laughs> it's it is. Our Honestly, it is. Our, our standard down Come on, members. Yeah. You can't expect this much. Like, you like, know how they say it. Like, I think any of you just, if we focus on the pitch performance, it, we're always going to be happy. Yeah. Or the supporters. Or the supporters. Or the supporters. Stuff. Yeah. But, but anything but done by FO, FO yeah. yo, it's not good. Like, the worst part of the celebration. I mean, I mm-hmm. love Ian Joy's energy. He fucking broke yeah. yo. Yeah, that was, brave that's heart that was Yeah, very brave heart. Very WWE esque. Sons of Scotland. Sons of Scotland. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he was out there. Wow, Shouts to you, shit. Ian. Thank, and I'm glad you and uh, my Joe man Joe Tolleson are Tolleson in the Tolleson booth. Are back in the the pool. goats. Um, yeah. Other than that, it was just like, God damn, this is pretty bad. Then the worst part of the whole thing happened. Fucking the banner. <laughs> like literally, this flag is bigger than the banner. The that postage stamp. Yeah. Yeah. It was. It was a postage stamp. We'll put a put, a, right put here, a picture look. of it. There you go. <laughs> shit was so it was like yeah. that. It was so Except small, with a star. So awkward, and, it, and that's like the official banner that's gonna yeah. stay at Yankee Stadium. No, zip tied up. It was zip tied. Up. That shit so, is not there right now, bro. Someone no. told me we he was still in the stadium and saw them rip it off already. God, damn, bro, bro. I, what did I tell you in the stands, bro? The way from just looking at it, I was like, that is not a permanent fixture in the stadium. Yankee yeah. Stadium is like, fuck you guys. Even, they didn't even cut off the excess yeah. of the zip ties. Them shits was sticking out yeah. like, like. Crazy hairs. Like you see the, them stretch it. Like yeah. you can see the stretch. Uh, like the, the, stretch the excess. Marks, That's what I'm saying. The, expo- the excess. It still had wrinkles on it. 
Yeah, the wrinkles. You they didn't even see steam it. it. They didn't they even steam, steam that shit. Oh, Herb, he's an excellent <laughs> steamer. Come on, guys. <laughs> Look at this quality work. <laughs> Come on. We ain't fucking barstool out here. We ain't amateurs. <laughs> Who you think this is? No, we embody the city. <laughs> we embody the city, yo. We no. steam. But that shit was just whack. Speaking about embodiments. Oh, God, yeah. That shit was whack. That shit it was, was very it was bad. Was Absolutely embarrassing. Whack. Bro, the amount of memes that have come out. Let's go through like a quick little montage of all the like memes. Three or four memes. One, right, send two, me all three, your, your favorite three. memes. I'll find them, yeah. And then, uh, I'll, I'll post them right now. There you go. <laughs> do, 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 do. <laughs> <laughs> no, the MLS did a write up of like moment oh, throughout of the weekend. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they wrote like with the like showing of that sign. And then it was underlined, meaning it's, they clicked it into. Like a link to another article about yeah. it, and the article was just ripping it apart. Because why not? It's just you're open for the Yo, major media companies, uh, Bleacher Report. Uh, yeah, a lot of these big yeah. media, sports medias. Yeah, like major national and international sites, like destroyed this team. Oh, that. why not? I mean, you open yourself up. For you know what's the crazy part about it? It's like, all right, the banner is small. But the font was even smaller. Yeah, like the they could have made the font smaller, bigger yeah. within this sli- oh. tiny dimension. You could have made the font bigger so people could actually read what it said. They went to pop copy and told Dave Chappelle. <laughs> pop copy. Yo. Because <laughs> fuck them. That's why. <laughs> that's, exactly that's, that's exactly what, that's what, what happened. happened. <laughs> Should I say what the what the certain staff member told me? I don't know what the certain staff member told I used me. To, so I, I, think would, yeah. I would love to know what the certain so, staff He goes, said. he saw it. And if it was up to him and in his call, he would have canceled it. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. It. And can, That's uh, fucking embarrassing. The whole ceremony, though? Like the, the, everybody, banner, the banner, banner would have been canceled. Yeah. But you can't have been. a ceremony without an unveiling. But the unveiling to that? Trash. There had to be an unveiling. You could have just said uh, uh, um, supply shortages couldn't get the banner in time. And we would have been like, oh, okay. Yeah, yeah it makes yeah. sense. Like, would we? Sense. I feel like we would have been just as pissed, though. Nah. Well, no, because if nah. you went to the team store, you understood that there was nothing in the team store yeah. also. Yep. Yeah, Yo, but then that was Hunger Games in the team store. Yo, bro. It was absolutely yeah. Hunger Games. Yeah, bro. If you, you saw a star had, on your jersey. And the only thing they like had this. access of was this <laughs> new scarf that I didn't buy, but it was $40. Yeah. I got the mug. I got the MLS Cup Champs mug. Oh, you did? She was nice. Nice. Yo, but actually. Real quick, just so everybody knows, at one of the other team stores on the way to the actual one, I don't know what it's like called. Like the outside? Yeah, it's like kind of like half outdoors. No, actually, it was fully enclosed, glass doors and everything. It was a smaller one than the team store. They have replicas of the new kit with the star, no dude wipes. Oh, they had God. those in the team store? Yeah. Oh, okay. But well, I'm replicas. just saying, because a lot of people were tight that they Yo, had to get so the authentics. There were so many few star, uh, uh, jerseys. With the stars, with the star, there was like sizes. There was yeah. very little available for stuff. Yeah, I was told in Hartford that that was going to be the case. That there's going to be very limited supply of stock. Right. Like it was like very it was, spur, like super sporadic. It was like yeah. you either could have already customized with a team or the a player's player. name, yeah. and no dude wipes. You could have plain with dude wipes, or so star That's what I got. I or replica. The, um, the blue joint with the star, but it has dude wipes. On yeah. It. So. You know, it was kind of whack, but wah, fuck it. Wah, what am I going to do? Want to get into know? this game? Hell yeah. yeah it was a game. game yo. Forget about it. The champs made their debut at home. The champs finally made their fucking debut. It was bricky back. brick. The kings are back. Yo, ill banner, by the way, bro. Mm. Thank that you. was fucking dope, yo. I don't have nothing to do with that, but thank you. Oh, okay. <laughs> so I, I did. I, like, I, uh, I, I supplied uh, the location, and I worked the, <laughs> and I worked the grill. People, the, uh, my la- no. the laborers didn't go hungry. They had their lunch break. That's a lot. They had their lunch break, you know? Yo, what I what I liked a lot about the game was we came with the energy. The same energy that was in the stands, that was in the march, you felt it on the pitch. The team was hungry. Mm-hmm. Uh, four minutes into the match, um, there's a pass from Morales. He he passes it to uh, Keaton, who who does that fucking he turns that him. beautiful fucking through pass to Tati, and Tati just I mean he he, he was wide. just off by like barely. I don't know, maybe a foot? What do you think? Like a foot? Maybe less? About, about there, yeah. yeah. But from that moment, it was like, It, it deserved it a dive. Yeah. It deserved a dive. Yeah. I was like, oh, it's... Yeah. See, the thing is, about like, the internet... Let's get it on! That's yeah. how I felt. The, it the, the internet can make... My city. <laughs> put, put on for my city. Put on for my city. Put on. The internet can make all the fucking memes about us that they want. Yeah, come see us on the fucking pitch. But on the pitch, yeah. or, the pitch or in the stands. Oh, Y'all can't fuck with us, One of the memes was like, the the banner is a regulation size... Oh, <laughs> oh regulation size. In quotes, you gotta find it. You gotta find it. Regulation size. 
Yeah, yeah. Find, find that so we can put it up because that's just the Yankee like, Stadium field. Yeah. <laughs> I saw I saw one that the championship banner is the same size as the pitch. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> that's fucked up, yo. Nah. But yeah, the, they did come with that energy. <laughs> nah, they did. Yeah, yeah. Uh, six minutes into the next. You want to get into the lineup real quick? Oh, the shit. lineup yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, lineup sorry, was different. I'm, I'm bugging, yo. All right, so we My got. Bad, I'm excited for this game. Sean Johnson and goal. From right I mean, to left, we have Andres Sean Jason John. starting mm-hmm. for, I guess, uh, Tayon Gray is. Oh, this is a big lineup, too, yo. Is, 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 is still injured. Lineup. Yeah, sorry. We about got uh, Tiago Martins making his uh, MLS starting uh, debut. Yep. We got Alexander Kayans. And. A month on the left, we have uh, Keaton Parks and Alfredo Morales on the pivots, and then we have from right to left uh, Santi Rodriguez, um, Maxi Morales, and Tyus Magno. And up top, of course, excuse me, uh, Conti Castellanos. Yeah, I remember telling you it was like because I saw uh, Martins, I was like, oh shit, we going through at the back, and you're like maybe, and then I was like, we both were like, yo, Shano's not on the pitch. Yeah, like, oh shit. And I, that threw me back, almost took, not took me by surprise, but I was like, all right, are we going to see finally a good actually rotation of the yeah. of the bench to starters? Because what, what Dylan this, said that today in the press conference, he said, um, um, paraphrasing, he said, have he's very, very happy to have three good options at center back right now. Yeah. Of course. So, but so we didn't play three at the back. No, we didn't. But he was he's ecstatic, and he yeah. goes, we have, I thought we did play. It looked like. It looked like mm. the uh, the two in front of them. No, what, what would you call no, them? So center, what happens is a lot. Center defensive? They, was it Keaton and? Keaton and uh, Alfredo. Yeah. Because yeah. you know, when we play at home, I think like they like to push uh, Munderson further up. Yeah. So it kind of like does, like it brings him up. And then Jason stays back a little bit. Yeah. But he's also just jetting no, forward well, as well. What happens is that they realize Montreal was doing nothing. Absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> No, because it is. Once you realize they're not doing nothing, we could just press everybody up and, yeah. and just Tiago Martin stays yeah. back. Yep. Bro, they were compact, but still letting us just yeah, do our rock thing. out. Like, all right. So they also look gassed. Yes. So Dial is happy about the three the three center backs, and he and he mentioned Lutinovich, and he he goes, "We have Lutinovich as a valid sub on the bench. He could stay in the sub though. He could stay back there. He could just stay. <laughs> he could stay. Buried. I'm, I'm good. I, I, I liked it. I I thought we looked. Yeah. No I thought we looked well. There were some times during the match where you know. Obviously, I, I felt like our defense was a bit shaky at times. You know, if, if if Montreal was a better team, there would have been instances where, you know, they might have had a shot on goal or mm-hmm. something would have went in. But you know, we'll we'll eventually get to that. So, yeah. So that was that was the lineup. Yeah, yeah. I'm uh, like you said in the in the what was it the the sixth minute? Yeah, sixth minute. The corner. Um, what was it? yeah the, the uh, play started off with the corner. Who took that? Maxi. Maxi. Right? Yeah. Yeah. So it goes to Jason. Um, who you know he passes it back into the back. Montreal fails to clear their line. They literally just fucking pass the ball right back to Keaton. Um, Keaton does this nice chip mm-hmm. right to Magno. Magno with his fucking just just his superstar awareness that he had yeah. just feeds the ball and fucking uh, off the volley. This dude uh, Collins Kyle. just nails this. Bro, shit. Like, he knew he, exactly like, where Collins what, was. What the fuck? He was just, that just, was yeah. He was just like, oh, my man's going to be right there. He's like, here you go. He just, like, kissed it off his head. Bro. Yeah, he was like, yo, you know what I mean? (laughs) Which one? You know what I mean with a dude where you you taking a shit and the water comes up and 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 it turns into Poseidon and he kisses your butt? (laughs) 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 You know what I'm talking about, right? Yo, what? (laughs) It's a comic. It's It's a a comic. It's like like four panels. So it's like the little shit. That's exactly what he did. Like, the ball came in and he fucking... <laughs> right to Collins. Collins put no, that yo, shit right. Have you seen it from bro. the side view of the of like the replay? I've seen all of views of yeah. this shit. Yeah, <laughs> is like a foot in front of the penalty spot. Like that's his sweet yeah. spot yeah, right yeah, there. Yeah, yeah. That left foot <sighs> right up the middle. But, shit, yeah. that but I love nice. their awareness though. Like he, he was like, "Yo, I'm gonna make this run" because I didn't get it. Yeah, dude. But that left foot of his, man. Yeah, gorgeous. That was that was nasty. I bro. didn't in live. I didn't see the the um technically the assist. Yeah, because it just looked like. It was just a chip, and they landed. Yeah, yeah. But when I saw the replay, I was like, "That fucking awareness, just to be like, just yeah, to do nah, that." Tyus is just... the real deal, bro. Yo, he yo, is. yo he Talis is, is a problem. He was yo. annoying us a little bit with his softness. His shooting, <laughs> his shooting, his shooting is kind of sus. He shoots like he's just trying to place it, like tap the ball in to the goal instead of. Well, maybe mm-hmm. he's trying to be a poacher. Maybe that's the the, like, the type of instead of trying to, to annihilate the ball. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, he's like placing them. His legs he doesn't have milk. real good uh real good accuracy. Need some calcium. 
But uh, speaking of Tyler's he having a great, some milk. great match, uh, by the way, player. Player of the match? Yeah, player of the match. No, no, yeah. and uh, he got listed to MLS Team of the Week. Team of the so. Week, yes. Sure. Presented sure. by Audi. And Heineken, so. whatever the fuck. Yo, I had a funny-ass moment, though, um, in the stands when uh, when, when Magno scored. Nephew, nephew comes up to me, and he's like, we're all celebrating. We're going just fucking buck wild. And he goes, does it count? Does it count? And I'm like, yeah, it counts. Like, what the fuck? Are you sure? Does it count? I'm like, yeah, bro. Why are you asking me? He was like, yo, because I threw mad beer in Hartford, and the goal didn't count the last time he scored. <laughs> so I just want to make sure 100% that the goal stands. I'm like, bro, the, the play already restarted. Like, the goal fucking counts. And they kind of waited, scored. though, on that goal. Yeah. They waited. There was a pause, yeah. like a, a, a waited pause. For the Collins? Yeah. yeah. That's kind of what sucks now with VAR. It's like every goal, it's just kind of like. Ooh. You kind of got to wait a little, little bit. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Now throw your beer. But hell yeah, nah. Um, that was a dope ass play. Um, what else? What else happened here? Oh, my notes. Um, we kept moving it, man. Yeah, we were after not long after that. We we got the second goal. Um, I don't think it was that long after twentieth minute. Yeah, the twentieth minute before mm-hmm. that though. I was, what I was saying uh, before, but Sanchez had mentioned. I want to say like maybe two or three pods ago, he was saying, you know, if we played a better team. Um, you know, a lot of these teams would be able to score on us because Waterman from Montreal. Oh, my God. Son, he had that nice-ass pass, but he didn't even hit target, though. You know what I'm saying? Son, like, that's yeah. like a meme when you see on, like, these soccer pages <laughs> where it's, like, tag a friend who would have missed this. Oh. <laughs> like, MLS. Oh. Yeah. Typical MLS were, bullshit. Like, yeah, it's going to be on, like, on Visible, yeah. Visible yeah, tomorrow. Yeah, 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 like, yeah. Only in MLS does you do you miss this? I'm like, but he missed it. Like he kicked it the uh, out. Yeah, yeah. he like, totally fucking just sliced the shit. I out. thought I was going. I, yeah. I was yeah, like, I thought oh, for sure that was all. I thought when they were going shooting towards, towards, yeah. yeah, the first half, yeah. But like you Order. said though, if 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 we were playing a better team, that they would like make them. They would have. They would have scored. Oh yeah, hell yeah. I think it make them. Yeah. Like the pass make them. Just it was just it was, it was just, just bad. An embarrassment of errors. Bad all the way. Um. Also, what the fuck? Montreal's on some other shit because they're like, oh, yo, we're going to play from the back in this low ass baby pitch, which we never play from. And they got caught pressing. We play oh, from yeah. the back. Not not all the time now. We play from the back. Not 100% of if the time. If it's Johnson, he, we, we play from the back most of the time. When do we most not? Yeah. yeah, when do we not, bro? We play from the back. There's, like been, a, there's been moments when they switched it up. Yeah, the, I feel like we Last we've year, we may have had up. a couple games yeah. where it was a I lot of. I don't feel of, like we were playing from the back out of this game. But that's like yeah. our like our, our like our mo. That's like our backbone. Yeah. That's like old faithful right yeah. there. I feel yeah, like old you, faithful, but I feel like we've been we've been dominating midfield, is what we've been doing. Correct, but I'm saying like the ball comes from the back first. That's what playing from the back yeah. means. Yeah, no, Where I know. The goalkeeper the sets it up. He gives it to the pass of the defender, which is usually Kyan's. Remember, Sands used yeah. to get that ball and pass it all the way up to the midfield. Yeah, that's we become from the more back. heavily possessive team than it yeah. is just playing straight up playing from yeah, the back. Yeah, but that regardless like, of where it yeah, goes, this is what I'm saying. Exactly. Like, be, playing from the back is still possession. No, no, I'm with you. I'm just saying the core has been from like Vieira, like just stubbornness yeah. playing from the back to now like if you can't get the pass from the back, then John Johnson has the okay to lob it. But then once that ball comes down, it's possession heavy. Yeah, so correct. Like, yeah, but okay, I'm not gonna argue this. No, it's I'm not argue. necessarily. It's, argue. it's like for me, you know, with the uh, the back line of Montreal, like they were struggling. They were playing three it. in the back. Yeah, they were playing three in the back, and then they, they wanted to press us because they wanted to press us. Yeah, but they were, they weren't doing anything. Correct, but that's why they suck, yeah. and we're good. They were just bad. Be- that's what I'm so saying. Bad, like, that's well, why we I said so if they were a better, better team, team, they would have scored on us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah so, they and did. then they did come out in the second half, full guns blazing, and scored yeah, on we, us. Yeah, we still yeah. got them though. Yeah, correct. But I, I'm just saying, there's like the, those lapses in time that if it's a better team, they're gonna catch those. They're gonna notice our weaknesses yeah. faster and yeah. take advantage of our 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 those moments better than a bad team like Montreal. Yeah. That's where I'm getting at. Before that happened, we still have the Santi Golf before the the half was over. That was yeah, that was, and that's that was what our, I was getting to now. It was just yeah. that was their mistake. The yeah, back. yeah, they tried playing from the back. Uh, goalkeeper ends up Keaton, passing it to Keaton. Keaton pre- intercepts yeah, no, like pass. a defender. Uh, he passes it to a defender. Defender tries to get yeah. it midfield, and he tries just, to pass it to the left. Yeah, and it literally just like rolled into Santi's lap. Yep. It went straight to him. And the keeper oh, was just off his line, and he just... Uh, uh, yeah. He hits that. Oh, yeah, because uh, then he just chips was it. Was it like square? And FIFA? Oh, lob? Yeah. Triangle. That lob. one lob, whatever. 
Hell yeah, just chips it right over the keeper. Fucking fantastic goal. That's when you hit it like this. <laughs> yep. Just popped Perfect. right over him. <laughs> you gotta say. <laughs> you was a slow motion. <laughs> 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 Now that shit was a nasty ass go right there. Um, I like that. Yeah, not, nothing else really happened in the first half. After that, you know, we kind of we played possession. We had the ball more. You know, obviously we attacked a lot more than they did. Um, second half started. I think it was what the sixtieth that they scored. Sixty second minute mm. where they Look, scored. I got it right here. Give me one yeah. second. Um, Jason got. Beat. Yeah, I think it was the sixty third. Yo, bad. Jason got fucking burned. Bro. No, they scored in the fifty second. But he got beat bad. In the 52nd? Yeah, 52nd. A month, a month and two that's also why I said, lost. That's why I said they came out the second no, half. No, they did. They yeah. really guns did. They had, they had spurts. They had a spurt. Because they probably watched the, the Comunicaciones game and saw like, oh, we could we could beat them off the half. They're coming off stagnant at a mm. halftime. Yeah. That's like our scouting report already. Because every game, I think the season so far, we've come out stagnant the second half. Mm. Whichever, every game. When we were beating... Uh, Guapilis in LA second half the first few minutes we came out stagnant it was like oh, what are we doing yeah, yeah, yeah. or we're just in the re- like we said we're calling it a game yeah. yeah you know we come out stagnant the second half and yeah, that's the doing that shit, man. and that's why we said a better team is going to take more advantage of that they scored which nah, they, they took really advantage yeah, they, they really just couldn't uh, capitalize more on it yeah because there was that, was that Milovic Mi- Mi- Mihailovic Mihailovic he, he, he did the run he, he did yeah, then he had the shit out of Jason yo and he, no, but then it was also Munson who lost his marking. Yeah, on the guy that scored, I didn't, I don't remember his name. Because uh, you could see, I was watching the was high- it Barrett, Barrett Guillard, I think it was our highlights. Yeah, that's yeah. the guy who scored. Brought Brought Guillard Guillard. Yeah, because yeah, yeah, you could cool. see him. He he looks to his left because he oh, knows he's supposed yeah, to. Yeah, once he sees he's it, running, yeah, yeah, he's running yeah. behind him, and then he notices he's running past him, and then he just he yeah, ended up just falling in front of the goal pretty yeah. much because he trips over himself. Yeah, but that was a nice pass by a fucking Montreal, though. They went, no, no, they went they worked everything. it out. That play yeah, they, was, that, play that, was that whole build up, the whole play, everything yeah, about that, that was. Yeah. You had to give it to him. It was yeah. like the whole you, shit was nasty. But the response, though, at least it wasn't put your heads down. It was it just was, nah. It was it was now nah, we was but, in for the fight. We but knew that's what we I'm knew saying. We, was into. we have to, in the WAP, in the communications games the same thing. We got punched in the mouth. They scored on us, and then we reacted. Yo, but bro, it's about drive. It's about power. You know what I'm saying? It's about hunger. It's about hunger. We devour. <laughs> we take Dick what's ours. ours. <laughs> <laughs> we was out there wild for respect, yo. And we came back, son. The sixty third minute, Jason came back with a fucking nice cross to my Who had man. a great who had actually cross. more better the one of his better games. Bro. Oh yeah. He played well. Beautiful. There's a talk. Like he played super well. Andres Jason is gonna beat <sighs> Gray out of that position. Oh, big facts. Big facts. Yeah. I think so. Because his crossing is way better. Yeah, way better how than many, Javon. How many assists a great guy? Compared to how many Jason got? They both got one, I think, at this point. Yeah, but yeah, Davis but got, looks better. Yeah, but got just one in an MLS Cup final. Mm. Mm. That's right. nasty. That's, That's nasty. nasty. Yeah. How many did he get in the playoffs? Like three? Uh, well, at least two. Yeah. I know two for Santa sure. Rodriguez, yeah. New England was his yeah. MLS Cup, and I... I don't know. If oh, that's right. He did get a few. Yeah. I was about to shit on my man. My boy. Nah, 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 you can, on his crossing, you definitely can't shit. I on think him. it helps. No, that on his crossing, you can shit you on. Can. Him. Yeah, he's a terrible cross. That's, that's what I'm saying. But Jason it. shows that yo, he could play the ball because yeah. Jason. Remember, he's a winger. Yeah, but he's a forward. Uh, yeah. Right. He's, he's he his his instincts up to this point in his career has been attack minded. Attack, so, attack, attack. So attack, he knows the attack thing part of the game. He kind of got that on like a. I don't want to say lock because he could always get better. Yeah. But. The way we played, that's very valuable from right. that position. Mm. Mm. And at Yankee Stadium, you can probably that's an extra you, winger. You can just say, "We'll we'll go. just play defense as best as you can." But you go. don't. That's not what your worry is yeah, today. Go yeah, yeah, yeah. move up. Yeah, he could be like a Medina, except he can maybe score at least set up assists. Well, yeah, but uh, it's like what Anton was, you know. Anton. Right. Anton was a good crosser. He was very offensive minded. And he's a know? better defender than yeah. all of them. Jason, but yeah. yeah, but still, I think J- uh, Jason's gonna beat out Gray when that position when Gray gets better. Uh, I don't know because it's just that Jason is so he's uh, he what is it fouls, flexible, yeah. he but he fouls. can he he can be put in and plugged in in a lot of different positions, which but, is good. But for now, but for now, because you don't want to be on your third string right back. But that's what I'm saying. But for now. He's the only right back option we have. Yeah. Right, which is great. Right now on that bench, there was no other right back. Exactly, which but is great. Like, no, he, and it's he has good time to develop a little bit. So when Gray gets healthy, I'm saying Jason's still going to be the starter, and Gray's going to be the backup. Yeah. Unless we lose a piece where somewhere Jason else. can fill in. Yeah, somewhere. And then else, yeah. we have Gray starting. Yeah, but these heard, are all good I problems. Heard we're signing Messi, and <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. Um, no more champions. Sanchez, right? So he could get booed at. Who would you pick for what? If you were head coach of NYCFC, New York City Football Club. 
and you had to make a choice for Saturday's game against Philadelphia. Who's and, your starter? And Gray was healthy. I'm Who are you picking, Jason or Gray? It depends who's who, who got the drive, it? who got the power, <laughs> <laughs> who got the hunger. Who wants to take what's theirs? Who got the desire? Who, who got it? <laughs> but also who plays tomorrow. If Tavon is healthy on Saturday and Jason um, plays tomorrow. Yeah. No, yeah. I think tomorrow, I, Tuesday. Sorry. I think I think um the thing is that we it's hard because Philly's gonna try to uh, revenge yeah. him. They're gonna try to <laughs> avenge about the fucking rock. <laughs> <laughs> they're gonna try to avenge that loss. So they're gonna fuck them, yo. So they're gonna come out heavy duty with it. I'm gonna still put Jason in. I'm gonna still put Jason in. Yeah. Right now I'll put Jason in because let Greg get healthy and really healthy. Yeah. And There's Jason's no on a good rhythm. You know, he's got, got yeah. two good games behind. He got the rhythm of the night. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it gets so rhythm so nice. <laughs> <laughs> that shit was so funny, bro. <laughs> Classic. They were doing right? yeah. oh, Of course. That radio? Yeah. That was the yeah. <laughs> Anyway, last goal of the game, 80 oh, third goal. Oh no, we, we 83rd minute. No, we talked about Magnum. So yeah. the chip no, uh, the, yeah, the yeah, from Jason. Jason. Yeah. Great goal. Yeah, very oh good God. goal. Yeah. Talis is gonna be a problem. Which was also Yo, he's a great beast, build though. Yo, he might he might leave beast, to Europe before fucking Tati. Dang. That ge- that was a great he build was being though. being scouted by Liverpool. Yeah. Yeah. Magno? Jason? Yeah. Liverpool. Uh, Jason or Magno? Oh, Magno. Magno. Oh shit. Before his knee injury, he was getting scouted by top European yeah. clubs. If Man City wow. then he had that knee injury. Yeah. Yeah, and it was just it just derailed all of that. Mm. He was a I remember he was a highly regarded youth in Brazil, right? Yeah, like part of the national he teams. He was like and all he that. was like they were like comparisons of the, as like the next Neymar with him. Oh my god, you yeah, we got him. So he hurt his yeah. knee. Lock yeah. him down three years. His brother or his cousin, somebody with his last name, plays in Brazil professionally. Oh, so like cool. it's part of so his. So did he? He played in Brazil. Who? <laughs> Magno, Tyus. No, I'm saying his. Like that's what I'm saying. He played professionally oh, yeah. also. Like it's just in his family, so you he know, had, like, he he had, had the, the rhythm of the night. He had the rhythm of the night. If Man City blows this lead for the Premier League, they're gonna call up Magno. <laughs> what are they up over now? the summer? Four one, points, one point, four, or four, 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 but with a game four, in hand. Yeah, with a game, uh, and they play Arsenal. On Liverpool wins. got a, Wednesday. That's called three points. That's yeah. might be three points. <laughs> yeah. so you might be right, yo. Nah, but uh, nah, that goal was dope, and that goal was fire. I almost bro. missed it because I, I was snuck into the not even snuck in, but I went into the supporter section to the stands. Just to see who was up there, yeah. And I was leaving, and as I was leaving, I get stopped by, at the top of the steps, you know, by the concourse, yeah, yeah, yeah. and bam! All I all I hear is oh, and I turn around, header, mm-hmm. and we were making fun of his headers before that too. I was at least I was. I was oh, like, Yo. I know. Yeah, because it was like soft ass headers. Dance, he goes, he goes, and he goes, he does that. Uh, da, 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 da. Yeah. He always does that. Yep, like the drop, <laughs> which is, <laughs> which I've been corrected is called Brazilian funk. There you go. Oh, that was the type of dance cool. because I think I just hurt my shoulder. <laughs> 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 I swear to God. I was like, oh, yeah. I was like, oh, like, oh, like, oh Yo, Rodrigo. Yo, yeah, Rodrigo. I think, Yo, Jose C. I right here. I think I pop locked and drop it too. I have to change that hoodie. Oh, shit, bro. Oh, we got shit. we got workers' comp insurance on the phone. Oh, nah. We ain't got <laughs> shit, yo. No, for real, bro. We ain't got <laughs> shit. Oh, my oh, God. Oh, damn. He told us something. <laughs> dancing like Magnum, bro. Watery, bro. Oh, oh that rotator God, cuff. Yo. Chill. You told your rotator cuff, yo? Live. <laughs> <laughs> Can you feel the rhythm of my arm? <laughs> damn. Uh, now you can't wild, tell him at work. Oh, I got hurt at work. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I got to go tomorrow and fall over there. There you yeah, go. Where there's no camera. Like my dad did. <laughs> 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 my dad got into a bar fight, tore his rotator cuff, went to work the next day, and fell. <laughs> Wow, <laughs> yo, insurance companies, please do not, <laughs> list, do not click play. He's a worker's cop for two years. He's a worker's cop for two years. Sixty G's, baby. They were like, "Ah, right, you good?" Yeah, a man's bought a house, bro. <laughs> 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 there you go. Yo, Poppy with the old flex. We know, now we know, That's bro. That's fucking funny, bro. <laughs> That's Going no camera. But you good? You good now? Your shoulders yeah, alright? Yeah. Alright, just leave my arm right. Can we talk about the eighty-second minute goal? Yeah, guy, there's no dancing with that one, right? There's no, no. dancing. There was a it slap, was, though. Was a, I think it was a little bit of this. He did something like this. Yeah, and Bear slapped the cheese, fuck. Cheese grater. <laughs> so this shit, so that man just comes, walk it Because they probably do that to him, yeah. though. True. I was going to say something about his bald-ass head, but you know. Big hat. <laughs> nah. Yo, um, yeah, 82nd goal. Again, these Chicago. fucking dickheads trying to pass from the back. 
they <laughs> they basically just he tips it. Yeah, he fucking steals Salucci. the ball. Yeah. yeah, he stole the ball and fucking yeah. scored. I like the way how he stole the ball and then he poked it out. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah, like he extended for that poke. Yep. And that gave him the room to get speed and go yep. get the ball, and he just beat everybody out the Very park. Very quick oh, yeah, thing. Now, man. nice ass goal, nice ass fucking goal. G- happy that it went in. Yeah. But it looked like someone on the field wasn't too happy that it wasn't passed to him. Tati. Mm. Tati, yes. Because yeah. all is, match, Tati, we haven't spoke about him all podcast. All because ma- he, on, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be real with you, bro. I love the guy. He's great. Thank you for our championship. What the fuck is up with these Rabonas he keeps doing? Son. What the fuck? Why does he keep it. doing I'm not shit. against it, right? Of course not. I'm not against it. If it makes not. sense. I don't, think it, I don't think it's bad. Correct. That Rabona he had, more than likely than not, it was a try intent for a cross, right? Mm-hmm. Right? We could all agree that it was, it was, it was a, his intentions were a cross, not a shot. Yeah. But he didn't, he barely missed that goal. Yeah. I thought Imagine he was going to that would have went in. Play Just like the, pure accident. Yeah. Play of the week. If it goes Goal of the week, easily. Yeah. Now I don't Stalin, know. They don't respect us. Yo. Styling and profiling. No, they don't respect us enough. That goal would have been sneaky. Yeah. Because yeah. we were having link ups like. Galore. Yeah. At that point, we were just like it was just Harlem Grow Trial. Yeah. <laughs> Bro, there, there was that one, uh, we had, didn't mean any. I didn't amount to anything. But there was a possession where I was like, "Yo, Montreal cannot like not even a wall can stop this ball from like getting through." <laughs> mm-hmm. It was we were just like one touch it and everything. Like practice. Just, yeah. Like yo, practice and like dude. Practice there was a one where it was just but like behind the back or behind like just some some like no look behind like. Yeah. You saw the the, the slow mo part where uh, they did in the in the behind the scenes video when Tati just drops. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. oh I, when I was watching that shit, that was weird. Like in real time, I was yeah. like, "God damn!" That was when dope, I saw yo. that, I was like, "And he, yeah, cause the I ball like, goes up and he just fucking whoo, he rolled out no, he rolled it. He just it it. It no, and then he megged the guy coming in. The guy comes through, boom, and then he pushes him. But the casual meg, it wasn't just like he was just like. He just like poked. I it was out. talking to Charlie. I was like, "Yo, this dude is so fucking cocky, bro. He's so cocky. You gotta bro. love it, bro. I love it. Nah, but he Why definitely he was upset here? though oh, yeah. that he didn't score. Nah, of course he he like, wants to. He, he I was telling he him, is definitely upset. When, it, I was telling Charlie that that he 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 wants to score. He's gonna he take it. Score. He's, he's gonna take what? it out on the Guatemalan tomorrow. This is three. No, 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 no. He wants to score in MLS. He Yo. hasn't scored anything yet. Another another um, key to to point to that that he does he's upset. When Tyus Magna was doing his dance, yeah. I'm not going to do it. <laughs> Watch his shoulder, though. Did you notice that he grabbed them and were like, come on, let's go. Mid-dance. Wow. Mid-dance? Really? Mid-dance. Watch it again, guys. Damn. Watch oh, it I again. Oh, I got to go now pay you, attention now, then. See, at this point, you just hating on my young boy right now. Yeah. You, know? <laughs> you just hating on my young boy yeah. right now. Bro, when the whistle blew, he was <laughs> he was in the middle of the pitch. Just with his hand in his, on he his head. He want to score, bro. That's all yeah. he wants Which to do. Which is he good. Wants to score. It's yeah, good. good. In yeah. that power yo, stance of like, yo, listen, bro, time. I don't care if you don't score in them. Let's keep scoring in Champions League, bro. Yeah, fuck it. We're going to win Champions True. League anyway. We're going to win Champions bro, League. Bro, imagine how good that would look. You get Golden Boot one year and then you win the cup in the same year. He's probably he's leading the Golden year. Boot right now yeah, in, the, in, in, Champions. in the Champions League. Yes. Pretty he got sure three he goals, is. I think, yep. in Champions League. Nah. Mm-hmm. Three or four. I think he has three in Champions League. Get two nice. more tomorrow but, plus an assist. But at least I like the fact that, like you said, I said, I like the fact that he's like he's not happy that he's not scoring in the game. Yeah, that's good. Because he's that's just, good. you just know that he's primed just to blow some bullshit. And I don't think he's angry with his teammates. I don't think no. he's no, 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 I think he's angry with himself. Right. With the yeah. Fact that he he's has frustrated, yeah, which he's is frustrated. fine. Frustrated. It's good. Yes. You know, yeah. it's it's a little struggle for him. But that's just MLS. Like in oh, the MLS, because he's doing fine in CONCACAF mm-hmm. Champions League. It's like nah. it's nothing to be worried about. The goals will come. Let's wait for the weather to get yeah. better. He's not in bad form. Yeah. No. No, no. He's, he's not, not in bad form at all. He can feel the rhythm of the night. <laughs> he got drive and power. Bro. Yeah. Because he the had hunger. His, and the hunger. Yo. And the desire. He, oh, yo, he does that. <laughs> he's going to take what's his. It's, yo, he really is, though. He really <laughs> is. <laughs> he fucking dies. Um, damn, I was going to say something about yo, him. Yo, the Rock wanted to sponsor us with that Terrama, whatever it's like. Yo, the, you know? Oh, the tequila. It's not, it's not bad. You put some ice in that shit. <laughs> I don't know. I don't it's drink it. It's a good. I've heard it's really good. I'll take a sponsorship. Yeah. It's good. You You've had it? No, I haven't tried it yet. I heard it's good though. Nice. Yeah, it's not bad. Bottle's like thirty six bucks, something like that. Okay. Twenty six bucks. You alright there? You stretching? No. No, it's not back there. No, he's back he's there. farting. He's farting. I thought, I, I, thought, I thought they had it here last time. I, I could bring a bottle. I I'll bring you want to bring a bottle next week? Oh, all right. Do. So next topic. Spin the wheel. <laughs> oh, spin the wheel, yeah. <laughs> uh, little baby 
Potpourri. Oh, I, I didn't realize reach. that thing was there the whole time. Oh, guys, did you see uh, Gabriel Pereira? Was, uh, somebody posted on their Instagram, and they Gabriel tagged him. Pereira. They said, good luck in, or goodbye and good luck in New wow. York. Is oh. he coming? Is it official? I don't know, but Sanchez. somebody posted that on Instagram. Get on that plane watch. The moment you see a little picture of him on the, I'm the follow him right now. What's his Instagram? Gabriel, look Pereira. up Gabriel Pereira. No, Gabriel Pereira. We'll see. We, um, anything look. else we want to talk about in the match? I think that was pretty much it. Uh, it was. It felt really good when the whole team came. We were all yeah. loud as fuck. Yeah. I was blowing kisses. <laughs> they saw it. They were catching it. I saw them. Tati, nice. you nice. know. It was fun. It was like felt really good. It was definitely yeah, like yeah. a celebration with the players after the match. It felt. I saw you. Uh, you. You he were does being following YCFC. Yeah, you see. Uh, there you go. Oh, yeah, you got. I saw Capo you with Capo again, yo. Yeah, you know, I said I retired last year, but I don't know. You know, when I, I it just feels like when you had the rhythm of the when night. you gotta when you gotta push the, the supporters <laughs> is a little you know up and down. I don't want to keep beating match. a dead horse, but you had the drive. <laughs> you had the power. You really did. You were out there just doing your thing. I seen multiple videos of you out there. So. Son, I took my belt Fisher. off. You did? Like, Who, who's like that? Chile, you like Chile. Like Chile. Uh, like, what's his name? Leo. Why would you take your belt off? Because to hang off of the uh, the fence at the oh, front of the section nice. in between yeah, yeah, yeah. In, in between so you the were stairs. Using it like a, to like balance. A yeah. Because I saw Leo doing it. I was like, it's fucking genius. And I did it too. And then we were just up there. I mean, it was like Jack Sparrow would, on the I side of a boat. Uh, I was following Leo because. You know, we, we can't see or hear what the fuck's going on in 236 while I was in 237. Um, but yeah, it was good to have a, a capo in the middle. Right. You know, so he was can, looking front and I was looking yeah, back. Yeah, so that we can get the rhythm of yeah. we need the a, night. We need to know. figure something out with it. Because <laughs> capos really seem to be, uh, really seem to be fa- a okay. factory to nah, keeping yeah, everybody yeah, yeah. in it's line dope. with the um, songs. I, I actually snuck into section 131 or 132. Um, I, I just I had How? A seat For there. what? Cause my my boy Charlie was tired. Oh, okay. You know, it was a lot of standing, walking, and all that shit. Uh, we just snuck in there. One thirty-two, I think it was. One thirty-one. I feel like um, I saw no security at the match. Oh, bro, we literally There's just walked none. in and no one bad an eye, bro. Not once. I didn't see security once. We security were security. Got fired. That shit was. Sanchez yeah, was security for our section. <laughs> Facts. Um, but we were watching supporter section, and I mean, y'all were loud as fuck, yo. Really? In the second, this is in the second half. Yeah, yeah. Really? It, it sounded fucking fantastic. Really? Just watching. Shit. And people were singing along. And when things would happen, they would watch the supporter section and they would start doing it in the little sections okay. too. Okay. So there was a lot of interest from these, uh, the sections on the side um, as to what was going on. That's so, near the was, corner? Yeah, so. The foul pole. Yeah, okay. exactly. Yeah, right behind the foul pole. Okay. On the, uh, yeah, that's usually pretty packed down there. Yeah, there was nobody mm-hmm. there though. It was, oh. it was packed, but we had a little section, you know, it wasn't. No. Like OD pack, but you nice. know, it was like maybe four or five rows that it was just yeah. empty and shit. Yeah. Um, other than that, yeah, the game was fucking fantastic. Yo, brilliant fucking game. You want to go over? Um, what do you think about real quick about the Philly game? Well, these bills don't fucking pay themselves, guys. So oh, I'm out of here. You out of here? Oh yeah, yeah. I'm gentlemen. Day. It was a pleasure as always I to see, see you all. I will see you Saturday. You gonna be at the match? I will be there. I'm Hi, gonna Bert. be at Bar 43 tomorrow night for the match. Anybody Hopefully, else I edit go? the podcast before then so that I can go to the okay, bar because so I would really like to go. Let's hope if we not, fucking I'm do watch it. Watch it at home again. All right, fellas. Uh, real quick, I'm gonna say we're gonna whoop Philly's ass this fucking weekend. Three zero. Score. Let's go. Three zero. Three zero. Nice. Two goals that. from Tati. Ooh. Oh, wow. No, you know what? Fuck it. A hat trick. This man's just gonna Whoa, make wow. up. Oh wow. He's wow. just gonna make up all his missed goals from the past few weeks. Wow. He said he saw that Facebook thread. He said he saw that they said COVID cup. He was like, "Fuck <laughs> you, bitch!" All right, get out all right, of go here. get out of here. Get out Peace. of here. <laughs> Spaced out. All right, man. Irv's gone. Put him in the. Put him in the bathroom. fucking bedroom. Get him out of here. Come get on. Get him out of here. Get him out of here. All right, yo, Philly. We got Philly on Saturday. Philly played against. Um. Fuck. Why am I blanking, yo? Philly uh, Philly San Jose played Earthquakes. They won two zero. Two zero mm-hmm. against San, San, San Jose, Jose Earthquakes San Jose. at home, which are an easy for San Jose has become an easy three points. Yeah. Um, who have they played so far, Philly? Um, <sighs> I feel like they've been pretty successful the past three matches. Okay, let's find out. So they played yeah. beat Montreal. Yeah. Uh, two one in Montreal, and then they opened the season. 1-1 one, one against Minnesota. 
Minnesota. Who? So they haven't been really put to the test. No, Minnesota. They really haven't. Be they rebel. Really yes, so Minnesota yeah. was a. But they weren't. Been, they're not a. They're not a. They're, yeah, right. they're not a great team either. I'm trying to see. So like I said, they stand. haven't been put to the test yet. Wait, 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 wait. You said Minnesota beat Rebel yesterday. Yes, yeah, yeah. One zero. Minnesota's not a good team. Correct. Yeah. Minnesota's not a good team. And uh, yeah, Rebel were jacking. They were the best team in the so league. So Rebel Last yesterday, week. all the Rebel fans were making fun of our stadium situation. Yeah. And they uh, can make fun of the star situation. It's all good. And we got to stop above our fucking. And our attendance. Yeah, it's all good. There was like seven people at their game yesterday. Yeah, trash. They're a trash ass club, yo. How are you? Night. They literally, I think, didn't even open the upper bowl. No, of course not. They, Why would they? They shit. haven't opened up upper bowl for for a minute. It's ridiculous. Yeah. It's been a while since they've done that shit. So trash. Fuck them. Way to go. Yeah. Um, how you feeling about this game against Philly? I'm. I'm I think, like I said, I think um, Philly's gonna come out and try to uh, revenge. Avenge the game that they think that they should have postponed because of the COVID situations. Yeah. yeah. But we beat them fair and square, 11 versus 11. And uh, I don't give a damn about them. Yeah. But I do think they're going to come out with a chip on their shoulder. I think so, too. But I do think. I think so, too. And they're going to get fucking yeah. washed, bro. And I think we're the better team still. Obviously. Obviously, you know? we are. So I still think we're going to win. Yeah. You know? The weather might be similar so this past weekend with the rain, because it's a one o'clock game, it's supposed to be raining in the morning Saturday. I yeah, but it's going to be hotter, though. It's supposed to be almost 60 on Saturday, even with the rain. Yeah, that's consistent rain, though. Yeah, that's so rain. Good, though, man. Agua. Agua. Aguacero. Yeah, um, yeah I, I think... It's supposed to be six, about 60 yet. I think um, this match against Philly is going to be a fucking a slugfest. You know, they're going to be... Mm-hmm. It's going to be chippy um, from the beginning. I'm... I'm Let's see if they they come in numbers. I I doubt yeah. it. They don't really travel well. Um, I, I would I would expect they do come a little bit because like I said, their fan base is with a chip on their shoulder. Like also. what you think? Like fifty or like two hundred, three hundred? Oh no, I you know I saying? would hope like, if it was us, we we're going out there too. We would we would five hundred. That's an easy even regular season game. Yeah. Regular season game. Yeah. Is what I'm I saying. would hope at least a hundred people. We'll That's see. two bus worths. That's a good showing. Yeah, a hundred people yeah. is a good showing. And we'll two bus. They should be, cu- but it's a good showing. Yeah. hundred people is a good is a good showing. Yeah. yeah, it's better than twenty people. Yeah, and it's and it, obviously it's not two three hundred, but hundred people is a respectable number for an away game, mm-hmm. uh, an early game too. At that, you know, for them. Yeah, yeah. yeah. One o'clock. That means they got to yeah. get up early. You know, gotta we know what it is. Yeah, they yeah, get up at the o'clock. bus stops like at eight, nine, eight, seven, eight yep. in the morning. You know, yep. gotta eat your hoagies and whatnot. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> gotta get your Philly cheese and all that. Yeah, get them Johns. Uh, get them yeah, Johns. We was talking. The At the wrestling match, yeah, the dude looked like he's straight from Philly. <laughs> Ball hat, big, big ass beard. Like, yo, this way shit. Uh, yeah, me. <laughs> basically, <laughs> basically, basically, he basically Dave. Look like me and shit. Um, but yeah, I think it's gonna be a chippy. I, honestly, I feel like this is gonna be match of the week. Mm. Damn, you know. Yeah. We think score wise, Irving said Trey Cero three zero. Yeah, he's he's kind of wild. I think it's honestly gonna be one one or two one. I don't think it's gonna be a real high scoring game. Mm. I think it's gonna be very physical. You gotta remember, we're going to Guatemala, uh, flying back to Guatemala, flying, flying back, flying back yeah. from Guatemala. We might be gassed. Uh, yeah, we might be, be gassed. Uh, we got a mid mid game. Mid Luckily, game we have week. a decent uh, uh, mid week game. Excuse me. We have a decent break. So because it's a Tuesday night game to Saturday. Yeah, it was it's some time. There's. An, you know, they're the still tra- training in there. Yeah, man. yeah, but it's it's it, it's not Wednesday to Saturday. You know, yeah, yeah. it's it's an extra full day. Like there's there's a window. I would expect a a, a legit starting lineup to be. Well, honest. actually, no, because Wednesday is a travel day for us. Yeah. They're not traveling back on Tuesday night. We don't know, but yeah, yeah, probably not. But yeah, still, so. still, you got yeah, tired legs, tired bodies. Mm-hmm. Um, but up for it because of the yeah, now the, now everything that's circling. Our team knows what's what's on stake yeah. at that game also. Yeah. You know they they'll, they know. Um, no. Yeah, what what are you thinking, Sanchez? Score wise, I like that two one. Yeah. I think our defense still has holes, and they're a better team than than Montreal and Vancouver. Yeah, in the sense that they might be able to capitalize on our mistakes. Mm. I really mm. feel that uh, LA didn't really capitalize on our mistakes. We made a lot of mistakes. Yeah, uh, that first match against LA, um, and they're looking like one of the best teams in the league. Uh, even so, even with the holes in our defense, I feel like, you know, they've also played not so great teams. Yeah. So we'll we see. were their hardest game so far, I think, and yeah. they only won yeah. one zero this weekend. And it was on a like you need to teach up. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty much. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Well, what about you, Yusuf? What are you thinking? I'm thinking two nil, us. Okay. Not necessarily. That's gonna be the 
performance of a lifetime in defense. Yeah, yeah. But I just think either Sean Johnson just comes up with some big saves and they As just always. can't find the back of the net. Mm-hmm. But 2-0. Okay. Yeah. Nice. I like it. I dig it. Um, Yeah. Uh, that, it, it kind of sucks that we can't really preview the, the next match. Correct. CCL match because yeah. – uh, the by podcast time is coming out on Wednesday. Yeah. The game is going to be over by then. Uh, but how was want, Hartford, though, bro? Unless you want to come back tomorrow? Nah, I'm good. <laughs> I'm Imagine. Good. <laughs> just do it. He's like, insert it. <sighs> Live from my bedroom. Mm-mm. Yeah, I mean, when am I going to edit it? Right after. <laughs> at 2 in the morning. I mean, technically I could. But <laughs> <laughs> technically but you don't want to. Nah. <laughs> that's, yeah, that's the other issue. I don't. Hartford, I took the bus. I went on the Templados bus. Nice. Shouts to them. Shouts to them. It was from uh, City Field, which is convenient for me. I'm from Queens. You know, it's right there. Bada bing, bada boom, you know? Yep. And uh, it was a decent ride. I don't even remember. How, it didn't feel that bad going up. It felt didn't feel that bad coming back. It was just yeah. it was a comfortable ride. Um, It was cold. It was cold up there? There was snow on the ground over there. <laughs> Where, in Hartford? Yeah. Hartford, oh, Connecticut. Oh. Snow on the ground. Yeah. Hey, man. It's north. It's up north. Yeah. It's up north. But like, and it was cold that week? <laughs> It was so cold. I felt I I, I had those uh, New England playoff feel of cold. Mm. That's how cold I was. Mm. I was a little underdressed, maybe, but I was cold. Mm. Yeah, yeah, that North Face still. That's the second week. You was you was kind of underdressed this this uh, this last yeah. match too. No, a little you bit. You was kind of cold. Little. No, I got cold towards the end of the game. I was yeah. fine the whole game till about the 80th minute. I will argue this: it did get colder. Yeah, Towards it dropped 10 game. degrees yeah. from the start yeah. of the game to the end of the game. That like, shit was, fu- it was, it was We could have benefited yeah. from one more layer, like just one layer, <laughs> a sweater <laughs> layer. A, a, a thicker coat would have been better for me. Yeah. Yeah. But uh, Hartford, yeah, we were outnumbered, bro. It was 14,000 people in the stadium. 14,000? Yeah. That's how many tickets were sold. <laughs> so, if, not, you guys if, were like 200 of those. If NYCFC <laughs> hit 1,000 is a miracle. Yeah. But I think it was closer to like six, 700. Yeah. We had once uh, about almost two sections. Yeah, mm-hmm. they had the whole stadium. Yeah, that shit wrapped was, around. It was dope, though, man. Like watching. I don't know if you've gone back and watched the game, mm-hmm. um, but yeah, you. I think it was you. You had mentioned before. Um, just when they scored first. No, we scored. no, no, we scored. They, they, we scored first. Yeah, they yep. tied us in the okay. second half. In the beginning, of the second half. Um, but we kind of we kind of got that later. hit in the mouth. Bam! It it really didn't phase us though. We came back. No, like I said, in the ha- they came out at halftime, yeah. guns blazing, and we came out relaxed. Yeah. Yeah. They scored, we got punched in the mouth, and then we we're like, okay, we got to come back four minutes later, we scored. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You know, That's was- what I like, though. Yeah. And then I love that they were, you know, the cameras were cutting back to the supporters just going fucking nuts. It looked insane in there, yo. It was, you know what? It was a good thing about the whole atmosphere and everything. At not one point throughout the whole day, evening, whatever, in stadium, around the stadium, because I walked around the stadium after the game. That I feel threatened for yeah. my safety. Oh, good. Especially I, coming off of that, uh, the fucking the win. That, no, that fight in Mexico. Yeah, correct. You know? I did not. I not one moment that I feel bad energy coming from Watermelon. Oh, that's not dope, one moment. I don't think there was that's a single good. incident. It was such a great vibe. Yeah. Um, with the wind was sweet. Um, it was cold, but it was fun. Like the stands was fun. Like the sports yeah, section, yeah. our section was good. You know, it was like it was real. Active live. I yeah, think yeah. I might have bruised the rib <laughs> because I dove from the third row at halftime. I was in the first row the first half. Yeah. Then they got kind of packed at halftime. So I moved to the third row and I was next to Chewy. And I told Chewy, if we score, I'm diving from here. Swan Tom bomb. <laughs> Just all over. All the way to the first row because there was like a. a, 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 a yeah. <laughs> don't, don't tear that rotator cuff again. <laughs> Swan Tom bombing down to the nah. stands and shit. And yo. then, because there was like a rail all the way at the bottom. Yeah. It wasn't like a wall. It was a rail. Mm-hmm. And that's what I did. Second goal uh, when they tied us. So then we we went, we, when we scored our second goal, which was the Maxi Morales goal, yeah. I dove. I just jumped all my might. Boom, mm-hmm. right on the rail. And everybody, I guess, followed the lead. Yeah. And there was like 100 people on top of me. Fucking avalanche, so, yo. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. That's dangerous, yo. Fuck it. Fuck it. Vago. I'm not, no. Vago was next to me and he was like, hit off me. I can't breathe. I was like, shut up, Vago. <laughs> <laughs> you got to you 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 believe, believe we gotta, to breathe. <laughs> we, we, come on, we score a goal. You got to have drive. You got to have power, Vago. <laughs> he was visibly in pain. 
Yeah. Uh, I was in pain also, but I knew it's momentarily. Like yeah, I yeah, already yeah, had, yeah. I already knew my mind. Like I'm not gonna be in this pain all night. Yeah, yeah. But on the way home, I was like, oh damn, my whole rib cage hurt. Because yeah. I did it. I didn't fuck my night because I didn't. I don't no regrets. <laughs> no Because the third no one, I did it again. <laughs> oh no. You know, I should have came out like Macho Man this one. Oh yeah, <laughs> <laughs> the fucking oh. Yo, boat drop, brother. <laughs> yeah, that's fucking wild, man. Nah, well, that's what. Um, yo, but we've seen pictures and videos of uh, what was it, the player, not the players, but fans outside of the player stadium in Guatemala right now. Uh, they're wilding out for respect, flares and all types of shit. Yeah, smoke bombs, fireworks. It's the yeah. you know the, what was cool about the Guatemalan fans in uh, Hartford? Two things. There was I told you guys there was gonna be any Guatemalans gonna go to watch that game. Oh yeah. Hell the there United. was flags and banners of rival teams. So it's like there. Uh, my enemy enemy of my enemy is my friend. Yep. At this point. Yeah. So pretty much. There was the, they were there supporting their basically their country. Yeah. And the other thing that was cool was on the players' behalf also, the Guatemalan players, is that they stayed back and signed mad autographs, took mad pictures. Oh, that's yeah. good, man. Yeah, because everybody it, was trying to take pictures of them. And then when the bus left, when we left, we passed by, I guess, the player exit. Yeah, and there was hundreds and hundreds of Guatemalan fans mm. by their by their buses. No doubt, and they, it's dope because yeah, was, you know they they don't get to see the team, and now yeah. they get to see them lose. <laughs> get waxed. Oh, yeah. So hopefully, by the time this comes out, you know we will advance to the next stages. Um, it's three one. Yeah, we're up three one. So they have there a is a way goal. Yeah, they have a crucial way goal. Yeah, yeah, so, so they just need to score two in order for us to go to over uh, extra time. No, we they, we would lose. No, yeah, we would lose. Oh yeah, yeah, because they have the, the tie. Goal. Sorry. Yep. Yeah, they have the tie break with the way goals. Yeah. So we gotta go just score one. Yep. Yep. So let's see what happens. Let's see. Mm-hmm. Um, yo, this is crazy though, man. We great fucking podcast, great vibes, uh, great march. Great stadium atmosphere, great fucking win. I've been a good I'm week, excited man. for 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 Philly. We got the new SCs coming out, you know. Um, and we're gonna take a quick little break. We're gonna bring Carol. She's gonna talk about uh, the new SC, notorious SC. So we'll see you guys in the next segment. All right, y'all. We're back. We have the presidents. You guys are the presidents, right? She is the president. She's the president, and we have what, what's your role, Sanchez? I don't want to wait. Oh my God. We have Dawson's Creek. We have Joshua Jackson. <laughs> Joshua Jackson. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we have Carol Martinez, president of the new uh, supporters club of NYCFC called Notorious SC. Yes, correct. Give you a stand ovation right here. There you go. There you go. Welcome to the podcast. How you doing, Carol? Good. Thank you for the invitations. Of course. Oh, that's of a course. great name. I fuck with the name heavy. Yeah. How much fire. do you fuck with it? A lot. <laughs> Do you fuck with it enough to join? Said. Uh, <laughs> no, no, no. Oh, okay, okay. So you really don't fuck with it that much? Like, uh, nah. You really don't fuck with it that much. All right. First question. <laughs> <laughs> the first question. The obviously. Uh, how did this come about? Talk well, to us about you know like. I, I guess that, yeah. That how, first, how when guys, was the first time you guys had maybe the idea then? When was it real? Like, oh, we're actually going to h- go ahead and do this. Okay, this started happening during the playoff. Before playoff, I was I always try to convince Sanchez to help me with start over again. Not only you, but yeah, <laughs> everybody, Dave, Josh, Tohi. Toji, nephew, Gabe, everybody was coming after me yeah. all last year to yo just get SC back together. <laughs> I'm like, no man. Everybody sounds like that. Toji does. Toji <laughs> <laughs> <Toshi> does. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> so during the playoff, I, I realized that a lot of people tried to send message to me like like on oh, no, only to bring him back. It was like. Um, Carol, can you help me with tickets, with uh, bus tickets or tickets f- for the games? And I was like, a, I had like a 20 message per day. Yeah. People asking me, asking me. I was like, a, this is hard to do it just for one person. I need to to have a group to help me to help other people. A board almost. Yeah. And Billy did a great job with the uh, YCSC. And that was sad that a lot of people was like a, like in the limbo, they don't know yeah. what to do at the time. So that was I was trying to convince Sanchez because he knew more about the group. 
he was the vice president for other years, and I, I was thinking like uh, he was the best person that can help me to bring SC back. Okay, so this is a rebranding of NYC SC, which was, stands for New York City Supporters Club. Yeah, mostly the the people that we are star are the same people that was in, in the SC. Yeah, basically the the uh, the board now consists of. Everybody who's on the board now, except one person, was on the board in SC. Okay, cool. At the uh, when, while I was still in SC, yeah. Nice. Okay. So now it's easy because we, we are all, not starting from the scratch. We yeah, we, we know what to do. Yeah, right. yeah, so we have like an idea of what to do, what not to do. Okay. How to go about things. So it's a little yeah. bit easier. I don't do I, nothing still, but. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, I guess, I guess my question is why, why come back, especially at this point, especially with. Uh, you see, like Third Rail, they seem to be doing pretty well. Templados yeah. are now an official, uh, recognized official supporters group. Um, why bring Why bring the SC back? There are a lot of people that they didn't, f that they think they don't fit in Third Rail or maybe fit in Templados. Mm -hmm. So that's that's all those people, and mostly we are really friends. You know, we are like a. We have this base that all of the all the guys that are right here, they are friends. They chill during the weekends outside of the stadium and anything. So we want to to keep that people like a help help them. Yeah, it it, it was easier because like uh, mm. when SC broke up, when I uh, it was close to two hundred people. I guess it was very close to two hundred people, like one eighty like numbers in the membership total, and not every single one of them joined another supporters group, right? With, whether it be Templados or, or Third Rail or whatever, anything else. So there was a lot of people that were just, like, in limbo, like she said. And and through the years, like, I've still continued hanging out with these same people. Yeah. You know, like, we travel together, we stay together, we get Airbnbs together. Uh, like, a lot of the people that are with us, like, I spent five days with them in Nashville. I spent three three days with them in, in L.A. a couple weeks ago. You know, it was, like, the same core group of people who we just yeah. always hanging out with. So it was a lot easier just to... Um, get everybody who doesn't have a home and put them under all one roof. Okay. Yeah. Is it is is this a group that anyone can join or like what are the qualifications for someone if they wanted to join uh, Notorious? Well, any anybody can join that is knowing an, another group yeah. because we don't want like a I don't know like a have like a problems with that but yeah anybody can join yeah. and to be fair, the membership approval process is going to be a little bit more, more, uh, stringent? more stringent yeah. than yeah, what yeah. SC was in the sense of. I don't we don't want to. to no, we don't want to make the same mistakes. We don't want to make. No, yeah. That's sure. a good way. So yes. we we know. We, we we learn about our mistakes. So yeah. now everybody can join, but for now we are taking like a baby steps, yeah. and just bringing the people that is close to us. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Yeah. Two okay. things I want to say uh, before we continue. One, the banner you guys brought to the stadium. That shit was fucking fire. The Kings are back. Yeah. Like, I, I, I don't know. You, I, I'm sure you heard me screaming my ass off. I was just going buck wild in the stands. Like, yo, the fucking Kings are back. The Kings of the supporter section. Kings of New York are back. That's my first thing. Second thing, the name. It reminds me of Biggie Smalls. Like, who? So, uh, there's a double entendre with yeah. the banner. Ooh. <laughs> bars, baby. So I like that. The one is the obvious one. Obvious, yeah. The kings of the team, the league, the NYCFC, they're back home. They're back. Yeah, yeah. You know, putting our presence down. But then the kings are back. <laughs> you know, the notorious ones, yeah. some might say, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now nah, that's why I like, fuck with the name. is dope. Like, Night of the Living Dead. We're back from the dead in, the, in a <laughs> sense also because, like we said, it's basically the same thing. But it's kind of like you're shedding the old skin. Yes. And this is just... A refreshed version, more honed in, yeah, version of a like, refined version, a yeah, refined version, rebranded like banner, in a way, yeah. And you're gonna be flying it because oh, yeah. that banner's still that's staying in the stadium. Yeah, 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 yeah. So what what do you guys think? Are you guys are gonna do most different from Los Templados and from Third Rail and you know everybody else? All the other different sects. You want to answer? Or you want to answer that? Because I have an answer. <laughs> <laughs> Well, like you saw it, like the banner, like uh, one of our key things that we want to do is just try to make banners as often as we can. Mm. You know, like 
I've talking to a lot of people throughout the years, and it, a lot of people who who think the way we do uh, say that there's there are more colors needed in the stands, yeah. in the sense of like banners and yeah. like um, displays and stuff like that. The tifos are great, but there's but only a handf- so quick. there's only a handful of tifos yeah. throughout the year. Mm-hmm. You know, and they're, hard, These are and more, they're harder in Yankee Stadium. Correct. Yeah, in Yankee so Stadium, the display, the visual is very difficult to understand what's going you, on. You you were trying to bring that more like season long kind of signage to the stadium. Yeah. We see in other places. Yes. Where if you have an, a, a specific player. Yeah. We'll make a banner for him or her. And uh, after the Tatis team. banner. You, you, you hacked my phone. Did I hack your phone? <laughs> <laughs> After the Tatis banner, you see that everybody loved it. Yeah, that, that was, was around all the yeah. media and even the um, Tati ha- loved a lot. He has the print. His mom. Yeah, she gave him Yeah, I know. I gave it. To, <laughs> I gave painted. Him a she she it hand painted uh, like a six by eight. It's on his thing. Like, yeah. yeah. It's, 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 it's right yeah, on because the I, I was thinking he wants the banner, but I was like, a, okay, what is he going to do with that big ass banner in his house? He's going to use like a sheet. He's go- I don't yeah, know. Yeah. And like I'm going to give him a little one. Okay, he can put it wherever he yeah, want and yeah. remember that More that personal. that day. That yeah, moment. Yeah. That's awesome. Nah, which that was which awesome. turns that was out it's it's true because he has it right on his TV next to yeah. Yeah. next to his Golden Boot Awards and stuff like that. Oh, He's all there. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. yeah, so much. after that, we realized we can do we can make uh, amazing banners and the. The, and the players they are going to love it, so that's why we are going yeah, to start nice. making more banners. Which is kind of dope if you because it's almost like if you bring it back to the what well, we used to be the SC, you had we used to do that. We had the bi- bad hombres, remember? Had bad, the, hombres? Yeah, bad hombres, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, well, was <laughs> that was a couple, that was oh, a yeah. classic that, bad hombres banner right there. Yeah, one of the groups under the SC used to be Ryan Apples, who also yeah. did a lot did of, of bands. So, yeah. who, who that some DNA those, is very much of what you guys are. So, I don't know if you right saw the other one that was notorious to see No War, no yeah. war. Yeah. So, they yeah, in the Ukraine, in the, in the Ukraine flag colors, mm-hmm. nice. They did a banner. Oh, I didn't see that one, I didn't see that, yeah, one. yeah, yeah. That was on top of us. Who did that? Who did that? Oh, okay, the uh, the guys from upstate. Oh, okay, yeah. That's dope too. So Paulo and uh, and Roach. And Roach, yes. Nice. nice. So. Um, the one I like too. If I don't know if you've seen the highlights of the match yet, but there's a part where I think it's when when um, Santi scores. Either Santi scores or when um, Magno scores. You just see the notorious banner. It just pops up. You see it like they. Mm. There's a nice shot of that. So yeah, I'm 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 excited for the for the banners upcoming. Oh, yeah. Yeah. What else can we expect from uh, from the notorious ones? Well, we have three goals. Um, one is the community service. We want to put more info, effort on that. Um, we realize we have a lot of we have a lot of supporters, but we are not doing nothing for the community. Not and as much as that, that should be be, no, should be, yeah. be, the, be happening. Yeah, we have a thousand of people going together or meeting together or having fun. Why we don't do something for the community? Yeah. When we were in SC, remember uh, you was you did a few food pantries also, Irving, yeah. right? We used to the, do the cloth um, cloth coat drives. Drive. We used to do uh, a food uh, f- uh, kitchen um, food distribution in the in the South Bronx in Hunts Point. Yep, yep. Uh, Paulo and them used to do a food uh, food kitchens in the, in the Bowery. So this is something that's like coming like. It's just being recycled back mm. into us. It's very much we, part of the DNA from what we used to do with that with, yeah. with NYCSC. Yeah. So it's just it's, we just got to keep that momentum going, you know. Now that the weather's breaking better, like it gives more opportunities. Now we more interested. Maybe um, we can start planning more stuff. But nice. Yeah. You say you had three goals. We have three. Okay. The the second one is just Sanchez talk about that is uh, paint the banners, put uh, more colors at uh, this mm. and the bleacher and the bleachers. And the third one is we want to help the people to travel more. Mm. It's like a, what oh, I yeah. told you, like a, people was trying to contact me to about tickets, bus tickets, or flights, or where are you going to stay? A lot of people ask me in the, at the watch parties, and like, yo, you, you travel a lot, how you do, uh, with, with which friends you stay, I can stay with you guys. So we want that the, the people feel like a comfortable traveling. Right. Yeah. And they can have a good time and fun. So, nice. actually, that was one of our responses to our um, question last week to our listeners, where somebody asked us how we how can, how do we do to balance out our work, social life, and soccer and mm-hmm. traveling and everything. So it's like, if you guys want, you know, uh, a group to join where they're gonna help you out with traveling and figuring all that shit out. Looks like you guys in in twenty in twenty eighteen. 
I think it was 2018, NYC FC as a supporter base, we were top five in the league away travel, travel yeah. outside of obviously the Cascadia teams because they used to travel large numbers because they're closer. Mm-hmm. But we were, uh, as a team, we were as a fan base, we were top five. That's dope, yeah. And it's been then, like that since year one. I remember the... No, but in 2018, we had like the... That was our peak okay. year. Because I remember watching the end of win the documentary of that first year, and they mentioned that, like, that NYCFC had the most amount of away fans that year. Mm. Which makes sense because it's you it's know, a new team, inaugural yeah. year. but even yeah. still, like, and if you see in every just, away game, it's at least one supporter. Yeah, yeah. every single so, away game. But, but some people don't know, don't travel because they don't know how to do it. They yeah. don't know oh, they're afraid who, to travel. who will stay. They're afraid or, to go. Or if it's something uh, economic, economically, it's like a, if I travel with three or four guys or more people, the you know the budget is going to be better because we are going to share like a hotel or Airbnb yeah, yeah, yeah. or mm-hmm. even. Ubers or whatever it is. Yeah, yeah. and Rides away days. Away days are always better. Well, first of all, in general, away days are better. It's a more of a bonding experience. But yeah, no, when course. you're with your fellow supporters and you're sharing this mm-hmm. experience and you're hugging them and you're screaming a, and cheering or you're that I, great bonds. Kidding. Like, yeah. the, like yeah. the bond I have. I went to the MLS Cup with nowhere to stay, and I found somewhere to stay. Someone let me crash on their on an, on in their hotel room, in the airport. They told me you come stay with us. Right. Yeah, because I, I was going there just to like. I'm SC a, members too, bro. I'm gonna be yeah. Former SC members. Yeah. Do you remember Speaking when we went SC, to oh. Philly? Sorry, um, we rent. We was thinking to rent a car, and we end renting a van because a little the other guy doesn't have uh, like a drive. How to go to the state? No, yeah. that was sorry. That was Chicago. That oh, in Chicago. Chicago. We one time in With, Chicago. Mm, in the hood. No the trap house. No, we, no, were, no. we was flying in and flying back the same day, yeah. so people didn't have like a go transportation. House, transportation. So in the airport, we were just like, "Listen, guys, everybody put in twenty bucks, we'll rent oh, a van." Right, and you guys yeah. picked up that random kid that random, nobody knew. Random people in the airport. Oh, yeah, that, that we the didn't real really, guy. That we didn't really know they were NYCFC fans. I'm like, "Yo, for twenty bucks, you just hang out with us all day." Right, and, and it was a twenty four hour trip. And you don't yeah, mm-hmm. and you don't gotta spend no Ubers. That was the spirit the spirit uh-huh. fly. Wasn't that the shirt? Yeah. Like, yeah. The spirit yeah. airline yeah. shirt. Yeah. So it was like <laughs> yeah, he makes shirts for every, the, everything. With the all Tim's all, logo on all, the side. All of that stuff <laughs> fell off on the first wash. Ah <laughs> yeah. that's why. Yeah, I shit. washed it the first time after that weekend, every single piece of that a stamp came. I remember yeah. I was so jealous. I was like, damn, I wish I went. I wanted that shirt. Yeah. All right. No, it's not that bad. So <laughs> I was just gonna mention um when we went to the World Cup, it was we only hung out with with SC members. Yeah. Yep. Oh. Yeah, that was like an SC trip almost. Yeah, yeah. pretty yeah. much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we know how to travel, <laughs> right? We do. No. Yeah. yeah. But even more, just you know how to foster a great sense of community yeah. Yeah, yeah. Hell yeah. within the group. And at the end of the day, that's kind of And like what she said, like a lot of the people who are in our group, you want to say how many people are in it already? We are 30 right in, now. In the low 30s right now? Yeah. So everybody's like friends mm-hmm. outside of this. Like I said, we've hung out. We hang out. We st- sp- stay together in away trips. So it's like it's a big sense of uh, community and friendship mm, nice. right now. And I love it. Which is carrying over from three years of since SC or two years, whatever it's been since yeah. SC's uh, death. Demise. <laughs> you know? Hey, so dark. Yeah. Yeah. It's it's not, kind of, we, we can just it leave is, that. though. It's sad. We can leave no, that it is, it is. It is. But no, I'm, I'm excited for you guys. I'm excited for the SC. I'm excited to see what you guys do, um, especially for the community service. The banners, all that stuff. Do um, you guys have Instagram yet? Twitter? Yeah, we yeah, have Instagram. Is I don't know it by heart yet. Let me look. Let me notorious. Me. notorious. I'll, I'll, put SC. It, I'll put it down on yeah. the bottom here. And uh, Twitter is notorious underscore, underscore SC. SC. Yeah. All right, cool. Oh, wait, hang on. Any uh, any more tournaments coming up this year? Oh, yeah. Oh. Yes. Oh. We still have the uh, Super Cup. That is Ooh. going to play it. Oh, the Newberg versus Templados? Yeah. Newberg versus so Templados. I'm, I'm on, the, on the Newberg team. No. no. Ah, nah, nah, nah. You saw, yo, when they came to my house to paint. Yo, I don't know. Yeah, what yeah, the yeah. controversy, when, when they man. came to my house to paint, they well, what did everybody notice? Where do I have the, uh, I have my winner's medal from that tournament <laughs> hung up. Because it's the only one you, you got in your <laughs> no, life. Hung so. up with like the uh, MLS Cup stuff. <laughs> we are, you are wow. so proud of that like medal. His F- first medal. His, his first, first medal. Hold, hold up, but hold up, hold up. Who are you, who are you going to play with? Newberg? Well, I Notorious paid. or for NYCFC Forever Podcast? Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. Wow. You know what I'm saying? I got my own team too, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, bro. You're on the contract. Yeah, you're on the facts. contract, yo. Damn. <laughs> 
Oh, Yo, yeah. we're looking for a new host. Uh, you can hit me up. <laughs> send your, send send your, your I'll play the Super nine, Cup. Nine, seven, I'll, help. I'll play the Super you Cup. You play the Super Cup, you can't. You, with, with, you with, suspend it for a week. You know? <laughs> with, <laughs> with, uh, like you're lonely, you can't play against the parent club. Yeah, we're <laughs> no longer allowed to purchase I'll play the any Super Cup with Newberg. And then whoever gets out the group stage, I'll play with them. Uh, right, so wow. you, just, you just roll with it. Wherever I may roam, right? That, that's what I said earlier. Yo, facts. That's why I'm joining SC. I'm anyway, Kara, is there right? anything <laughs> else you want to mention about SC before we let you go? Um, we have these hoodies. Oh, yeah. We have those hoodies. Very uh, nice. I love that logo. Notorious. Good shit, guys. Nice. Nice. Yeah. Love it. Oh, one thing. Um, I know a lot of people always talk about why we don't bring hip-hop music and all the things to, um, to the bleachers because this is New York and everything. So with the banners and that we are going to do, we can bring that, that vibe, yeah, you okay. know, the Ooh, triple that. entendre. I love that. <laughs> on that banner. Because the tilted crown. Wow, that's Biggie. That yeah. Yeah. was a shot to Biggie. Yeah, Everybody yeah, knew, yeah. Every, oh, a lot of people caught the, yo, that's the Biggie crown. Yes, like, that's Biggie's yeah. crown right there. There's a star in the crown too, so yeah, it's like, I MLS, that too. that's our little, I that you know, too. there's a lot of things, every, there's a lot too. of moving pieces, but they all come I have together. an idea for a banner. Protect your neck. I need that. Or something. Oh, with Kayans. Cause yo, he's a beast oh back there. Oh my god, he's a beast right there. <laughs> we were yeah. actually talking was, today. Today, like, what's today, the next banner? Today, I said, guys, I said, guys, look, yo, the next one is going to be to to Callens. So I need ideas. Protect yeah. your neck. Protect Thank you so there much. You go. There you go. Protect your neck. <laughs> Done. That's good. Oh yeah, that's good. Shit. Fucking love it. I'm hype, yo. Um, yeah. If that's it, we'll uh, end the pod. Anything else? All right, Kyle, thank you for coming out. Thank you guys for having me. I appreciate it. (laughs) Good luck uh, with everything, guys. Yeah, this is a huge responsibility. I know. No, you got got great support. To be honest, this is this this is not easy. Take this decision is not not easy because we we knew we know what happened before and this is hard. Yeah. But definitely don't want to make certain same mistakes again. Yes. Facts. And that's a big thing. So the good. best part of mistakes is that you learn from them. Yep. yep. Hopefully. <laughs> hopefully. Yes. You ho- yeah. Hopefully yeah. that you learn from hopefully them. Hopefully you learn. Listen, I take full credit of that banner, <laughs> but I didn't do nothing. All I did was cook. <laughs> everybody I came over. Space. Everybody I provided the space. Everybody was painting. I was cooking. I made rice. I made potatoes that I burnt. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, corn that I forgot to butter. <laughs> Sounds like you didn't really do a good job I with the cook. Yo, facts. I didn't yeah, do a man, good man, job. At least, <laughs> all the food. at least they ate. Though. They, at least, ate. At least they, they ate. They ate. Some pizza, salad. Then they yeah, yeah, they ate me some salad and it had some meat on the grill. Come on. Oh, so good. I was working. You grilled the salad too? Should have. <laughs> Carol, thank you so much for coming out. We appreciate you. We're very excited for uh, for the new things with Notorious SC. Um, yeah, good luck with everything. Yo, before we end the pod, I just want to say this. Hard work pays off and dreams come true. Bad times don't last, but bad guys do. This is the NYCFC Forever Podcast, and we'll see you guys next week. Peace.